We're back. We're back. Yay. Wake up, everybody. Um, so, last time when we were done recording, uh, Jeremy looks at me and is like, do we really have 50% of this game left? And I was actually kind of guessing from that point. And we went back and counted the events, and there's 31 out of 67 so we're, left. We're just so. we're like 55, 56 yeah. percent of the way done. But yeah. again, I, I, I'm Guess told, me. I'm told the game picks up near the end anyway. Totally. So yeah. like the, you're gonna start banging out quests, but we may be more like 60. percent It doesn't matter either way. <laughs> yeah. If you're in this deep with us, I assume you're along for the rest of the ride. <laughs> I sure hope so <laughs> because I am. Yeah. So. <laughs> Um, so this is a somewhat easy quest. Mm -hmm. We um, need to walk around a bit to have it trigger because you got to re-enter your house area. Um, another way to trigger it is to just place another artifact if it doesn't work. But it's supposed to be organic, but we're gonna yeah trigger it. We're, I early. think it'll trigger. Um, but it always happens no matter what if mm -hmm. you're this far into the game. Um, it's not a missable event like some of the ones that can be so that's good oh look we got it yeah uh is he okay is he dying <laughs> don't worry he's been chosen now he's going to the spiritual world to become part of a big tree hmm. i wonder what that could be a big tree yep plants are all connected by our roots i don't really get the cactus so like did you find him did he break into your home did he into your home. I have he's, no idea. There's is like he like, no lore. Is it like a Dobby situation where he's not really allowed to be out here and you're going to chase him back inside? I or? don't think so. I think he's just there. I mm -hmm. can't remember if like someone created him and like left him and you picked him up. There's not a lot of lore about like unnamed player. Um, so I guess you could headcanon that one if you really wanted to. Some things are just universal truths. Right. You have a cactus. He can talk. He lives in your house. He listens to your stories and writes about them. So, I don't know. It, it seems like a fun time to me, mm -hmm. honestly. So, these guys are talking to him uh, about the big tree. <laughs> seem like they're convincing him to join their MLM or whatever. <laughs> the tree cult. <laughs> yeah. So the thing about the Spratlings I never really understood is I th I get that the Spratlings are a race of creatures that are all like one hive mind or whatever. Yeah, like they're pretty much explaining that right now is that they spiritually, I mm -hmm. guess, in this other dimension, they are a hive mind with the tree, which is the mana tree, okay. which has been talked about before. Uh, the mana tree is like dormant right now because of the war. Right. Blah, 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 blah. Um, so they're kind of, I guess, waiting for it to wake up in that other dimension so that they can lend their energy to it to bring it physically back. Okay. That's what I get from but that, this whole exchange. I didn't think that applied to all sentient plants. Right. So now they're talking about it as if, like, everything in this world um, kind of plays a part okay. in that energy, whatever. Um, I don't think they're even just talking about plants. I think they're talking about every living being. Mm-hmm. Okay. He's going to become part of a big tree, then so am I. Okay, everybody's on board. That's great. Um, apparently, my imagination is what has done this, because I'm super all-powerful or something. Of course. The power of love as well. Uh, this The guy on the ground says, no problem. He's He's totally fine. He is not dead. Nope. He is ready to accept his fate. Mm -hmm. Love is what we plant seed the most. Thank you for your love. He's Aww. going to join plant nirvana, <laughs> become one with the universe. Honestly, man, that does not sound bad at all <laughs> i'm totally there for that cool so i forgot that i planted some stuff but sure I'll quick start. harvest before we move on yeah. so we didn't start a quest just now though right no i mean it's just an event it so do we go inside and talk to the cactus now and it will start a yeah. real quest yeah like that was Okay. That was the trigger knowing that this next event is going to start. Mm -hmm. um, I do have to follow him inside, and I think that's when it shows you the title. I'm just going to clean this area up a little bit. Sure. Oh, oh, oh. Really just trying to get seeds from this guy up here, and he's being a little stingy, <laughs> to be fair to me. Well, um, 
Did we ever end up building the sword you were trying to build? No. That has not happened yet. No, okay. We built the, the super ring, which we were pretty sure didn't work, but then it totally it did totally work. It totally does now, so that's good. I didn't do it wrong. This game is awesome because even when you actually like earn a reward worth celebrating, you aren't even sure if you did it right. right. Like there's no like, dude, you did it. You like made a good item. It's just like, <laughs> I think this is, is it good? Did it even Seems work? Good. There's some cards popping up. Like I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Yes, like flat seed. <laughs> I'm just gonna put it on and hope it's working. Mm -hmm. All right. I think I need. I need spiny seeds. Dang it. Uh, <laughs> um. Let me look. There's, a, there's another thing I want to make, but I. I don't think I'll be able to get it. Get it all in time. Yeah. Um, yeah. That's fine. Do are, are recipes bound to your playthrough, or could, if you theoretically got the materials for something, you would can you make be... it again? Okay. Yeah, you can make anything infinitely, probably. Sure. It just takes a lot of resources. Again, going back to what you know, I've I've echoed this a hundred times, and I may echo it a hundred more. It's a shame that player two doesn't have a consistent character. Right. Like I, I almost wish that, like. I could just play as the boy character and like just be in all yeah. the time and like have yeah. gear. That would be so sweet. Like, right. Like, I wouldn't even mind if the NPCs that were party members just either became passive in combat or just like were like, I'll run ahead mm -hmm. instead of fighting with you. Just so, because like, like, my stake in her making gear is very low like right. i kind of couldn't care less if she did or didn't because right. my character is just i press triangle and sometimes r1 yeah and i don't even get to add any of these weapons or armor to anybody right um, like they're purely for you like you can't even equip them on like dana or whatever it's just like dana wears what dana has yeah which they kind of just do the work for you by making those characters here we go. Oh, okay. Um, Quest popped. There we go. By making these characters like ultra buff as mm -hmm. soon as you meet them, so you don't have to finagle with them. Which, which... feels so counterintuitive because there's yeah. so much you can make and build and craft. Right. What is this guy? <laughs> what is that guy? We will return to that subject in a second, um, since we're in the workshops. But can I play as the disc that talks? He's so cool. His name is Nunazak. And he is a, I think he's a mage that long ago got trapped in this like that's awesome stained glass mirror. That's thingy. awesome. His lore is so cool. He's kind of a, a rude person though. What? But I would be if I were trapped. An ornery in a weird, mage. Yeah. I would, you don't a weird say. Disc. Yeah. So um, he keeps it real. Let's just say. Um, clearly he doesn't want anything to do with the monetary. He just wants to be on his own. And this is Belle. She's she very is adorable. Cute. Yeah, she's a little painted clown doll thing. Um, I don't really remember her origins, but she's adorable and she's very nice and helpful. So she wants this rattling back. Um, she's all for everybody going to the spiritual world and becoming monetary. Of course. Yep. But she's not a plant, though. I guess she just believes. She that might have a soul stuck inside of her. The cult is still spreading to like everyone now. <laughs> like where we're all gonna return to the monetary. Sounds like a good cult, though, to be honest. Sounds like there's some wonky stuff happening in the world and they might need the tree back. So we should listen to the doll with the soul stuck inside of her. Okay. Uh, the sorcerer trapped a Spratling in a dream using dimensional magic. Oh boy. Uh -huh. Okay, he's a sorcerer, not a mage. Sorry, everybody. No, the Spratling won't be able to become part of the monetary. Eh. Spratlings should remain as they are. They should not become part of the monetary. We're having a like high school debate here. <laughs> These are everybody's opening statements. Well, I don't know if the stained glass guy gets to become part of the mandatory. True, he might be feeling a little bit hurt about that. Um, kind of his fault for being a butthead in the first place, though. I mean, I guess. <laughs> so he thinks that, like, if the tree comes back, everybody's going to take its power. Okay. Because, yeah. He's probably right. Yeah, humankind is kind of greedy. Right. Uh, has mankind ever used the tree's powers for a noble cause? Not once. Must eliminate the sources of our quarrels. Peace is what we need. Is this still the same quest we just got? Or yes. is this something? Okay. This is part of the quest. Um, when you put it like that, I suppose we could have lived without it. I still feel bad for the Sproutling. I'd rescue it if I had the power. Well, this guy does, so. She plays our hopes 
for the future on we should not place our hopes for the future on the monetary. Okay. Um, <laughs> well, that's right. Now we have to leave. So our friend Pokiel is gonna be out here. Is Pokiel evil? Nope. He's a wisdom and he's mostly neutral, but I think he errs on the side of good. Okay. Yeah. I don't. Tr um, I'm. I don't. Yeah. I don't trust Pokio. He's not evil. He's, He's always cool. here to, in too convenient of times. I mean, he has a wisdom. He can kind of see what's going on in the world. I think he has a magic music box. Things are pretty dope. So they know each other. So Pokio. Yeah, this guy, I think, looks up to him. If I remember correctly, like, kind of cowers. Time has come for the Spratling. Let it go. Do the Wisdoms want war over peace, Sir Pokeel? You must be aware that blood will be shed if the monetary is revived. We have proven that we can live without it. Even if this is the Wisdoms Council, I will not heed it. Okay. So, sure, there's lots of old believers in the monetary's power. Um, love may not be a necessity, but even you understand its blessings. I don't know who loves this guy, because he's just a stained glass thing. Right, he's a stained glass wizard. <laughs> Which again, still cool. Still cool, yeah. Some will harm others or steal to attain those blessings. If that's true. Uh, when we desire nothing in our hearts, only then can we be at peace. So he's, uh, what would you call that? Um, he wants to shed all worldly possessions and desires. Um, yeah, what is... Is that kind of like Buddhism or... Yeah, that's kind yeah. of eightfold pathy. <laughs> yeah. A little bit. I think he just doesn't want anybody to fight anymore. And I get it, but I don't know. The monetary seems cool. Yep. Part of a vast universe. Unlimited power. Um, true power is found within. It's not the materialistic wealth that's missing, it's emotional wealth. Love. Love. Love? Love? Question mark. Love is power. Give it to another, and you will bring them bliss. Criminals, friends, strangers, even yourself. Everyone is reborn when you forgive, love, and understand. <laughs> you wisdoms are merely masters of trickery. With can I words. do a voice? Oh, that was good. I feel like he you sounds. You were so late on that one. What? <laughs> I I feel like I know what this guy sounds like in okay. my head. Do you want to do it on the next one? If he says something stupid like that again, then yes. <laughs> uh, you believe that fools outnumber the wise, and you think that you're at war with the fools. But you're fighting in a world of pessimism that exists only in your head. He's also a therapist, apparently. None of the creatures that the goddess created are truly fools. <laughs> All you need to do is believe it, and I don't your know. words become your world. We've kind of met some stupid characters. <laughs> yeah. I think God in this world does make mistakes. <laughs> you are preaching a dream. This is not reality. That's what he sounds like. Villains like the Deathbringer <laughs> will surely come for the mana tree. I don't think he sounds so menacing like that. That's what he said. That's 100% what he, he sounds. What he tired, sounds. But... As a, a, a wizard with the hubris to trap yeah. himself in stained glass, that's absolutely what he sounds like. It's possible. We'll never really know, though, because they decided not to voice this I just game, canonized which is it. a shame. I canonized it. And when they do, I would have to teach my pupils about true conjuration. Yeah, that's that's what he sounds like. The world would return <laughs> to an age of darkness. You speak of the past as if it were the present. Do not waste your life away thinking everyone a fool and then is ash. <sighs> do you think the goddess created this world only for us to suffer? We are all fools, Pokeel, every last one of us. If that is what you believe, then that is how it shall be. Sir Pokeel, wait! I am but an old magician. Please, lead me through this world with your supreme power and wisdom. I told you he cowers. I trust you to do whatever you believe in. Even if you decide to destroy this world, I shall pray for you. Everybody's like okay with someone else deciding to destroy the world. It's so weird. Like, they're just like, yeah, go ahead and do it. They all lead fickle existences. <laughs> Sir Pokeel. Oh. Salutations. Okay. Oh, <laughs> she's so cute. When you put it like that, I suppose we could have lived that laundry, it would still feel bad. I'd rescue it, she doesn't say anything new. 
I don't have to read all of his lines now. Okay. <laughs> oh. Oh. And what? he sent us to the dream world. Okay. That was a little unceremonious. Right. Um, I don't think I was supposed to bring anybody with me either. It's fine. It doesn't fail the quest, but... It's fine. I think they might not let you. There's... There's... Yeah. It's fine. Just get them. Yeah, I'm trying. Okay. Yes, sir. Doug, do anything, yeah, bud. Doug, please. <laughs> Doug's just chilling. I, I miss. I just, again, if there's a monster, or what do they call it, a beast? If sure. there's a beast that shoots, they are the best. That, like, just has, like... Yeah, there's a couple. Like a fireball that they'll just, like, blast. Because right. I feel like I your beast... Is one, actually. Your beast <laughs> spends most of the fight trying to line up their shot. It's true. <laughs> They have to like luckily get to where it's see them go. Mm -hmm. Look at Doug go. <laughs> Doug's like, I'm coming. I'm gonna line up my one shot. And then no, oh, the snake just bit him in the head. I don't know what that does. <laughs> I don't know, maybe he's cheering him on or something. Is this how just... ineffectual your co-op partners are if no one's controlling them? Like no, do they just sort um, of they'll... wander? Um, no. They are usually a little bit faster than mm -hmm. the beast, and they will um, they'll cast at pretty much the proper times, for the most part. <laughs> Sometimes they whiff too, but yeah, they're the humanoid like <laughs> partners are a lot better than the beasts for sure. Doug, you can do it. Get him. Get him with your snake. There you go. <laughs> dream. Cool. So this is the dream world. Uh, it's not very lively, as you can see. Ow. Weird. Doug, what are you doing up there? I don't even know what Doug took a Just hit from. Did. Yeah. yeah, that was weird. Uh, one of the little things, maybe? Come on, man. Oh. <laughs> that ring you made gives you so much health. Like, good I know. lord. Like, yeah. having a green Ow. health bar, that's like a boss amount of health. Yeah. Um. Yeah, it's not you too got him exciting in here. I know. God, dude. <laughs> I'm trying. Please stab him, I beg of Or Doug, do anything. <laughs> like, Doug, He's like... He's, like, clinging to me in such a weird way that the bunny doesn't do. The bunny just hops past you. But to be fair, I don't... I can't even tell you what the bunny's attack animation is. He kind of does, like, a spinny thing. Because I know oh, Doug has the low kick. Doug does a low kick and, a like, a peck that can... I think has the possibility to turn you to, like, stone or paralyze you for a second. Mm. Alright, found this guy. Huh? Where am I? I have to go heal the bunny tree. It's my job. Pluma, mm -hmm. take this sword. Close your eyes and imagine. Hmm? Me? Cool. That seems like an important artifact. It is an important artifact. Cool. <laughs> what? <laughs> huh? <laughs> what happened there? Wait, what? What? He's going to the monetary. Okay. Bye. Also, she rides a tape pig, and it's very cute. Okay. Or tapir? Sorry. I was going to say, a tape pig is, is a Pokemon. Pokemon. <laughs> Sorry, everybody. It's fine. I think I knew what you meant. <laughs> she rides like a tapir. I don't know why, but it's very cute. Okay, just mocking. That one, that quest is easier than I remember it being. Maybe uh, you, there was no boss or anything. You were just in and out. No, yeah. I thought there was like more running around that you had to do. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Now there's just more Sproutlings outside your house you have yep. to walk past. Yep. Story of my life. Call the cops on them Bunch for trespassing. Bunch dude. Yeah, get them yeah. out of here. <laughs> hey, I like the walrus lemon. Or the... What is it called? Uh, this is a boar melon. Boar melon. Yeah. Oh, if I can... Sir? <laughs> Yeah, poor melon. Mm -hmm. I'm surprised you just remembered the name of that. I I think I said this in like the second episode. If you quiz me just visually on what these are called, I can probably name almost all of them. Um, some of them I've never grown in all of my playthroughs, and I don't know how to do it. And I don't feel like sitting here and resetting my game a bajillion times to do it. Mm -hmm. Here's a, because we just talk about random things when you're doing your dailies. Yeah. Um, what is the longest game you've ever finished? Like, longest, longest. Longest, longest. 
longest game I've ever finished. Um, probably a Final Fantasy. Maybe Final Fantasy VIII, because I don't, I don't think I technically was able to finish my PlayStation One save of Final Fantasy VII mm -hmm. because my PlayStation freaked out some years later when I went to go do that. Well, it saved on your memory card, though, right? It was, but I didn't have another PlayStation to mess around. That's with. a pretty key element or a key part of the process. He's full. Whoops. Okay. Uh, yeah, I, uh, the disc reader got really messed up after a long time, and I tried to fix it, and mm -hmm. it didn't work, but I didn't know anybody who could, like, um, help me out with a PlayStation 1 or, like, a, P a PS2, and so I just kind of, like, had to let it go. But you did eventually finish 8, you said? Yeah. Or was it 7? It was 8, because okay. I was able to, I, I did that one earlier, um, when I was younger, and I was like, all right, that was a crazy game. I didn't really understand it at the time, because I well, really don't think that game is for kids. How honestly. long is 8? I Honestly, I have no idea. It's it's four discs, so around, probably the same as 7. That doesn't help I don't know how many me. hours that is off the top of my head. Um, someone come in here and correct me, please. Plus 100? Like, are we talking 60? I have no seven? idea. Okay. Please all don't right. quiz me like this. I just don't know. No, I don't know either. Four discs is like what I can say, maybe like six to eight hours on each disc, mm -hmm. maybe more. Because there's a lot of extra stuff. Oh, it's you definitely can do more this. than eight hours per disc. Sure. It's gotta be. I have no idea. I don't know time. For eight, literally, <laughs> I got. Um, I think nine, too. I, nine, I definitely finished because I enjoyed that more than eight. I came to all those games extremely late, like extremely after the fact, and I kind of was just trying to play enough of them that I was not ignorant to them. Right. Uh, and for eight, <laughs> for eight, I'm pretty sure the first disc change is the parade, and it literally begins with the fight against the queen. That's like in, disc two. That's in Final Fantasy Nine. I no, thought. no, no. That's eight. Isn't there that's a parade eight. In nine? No, the parade against the the witch lady. Yeah, that's eight. Yeah, no, the parade with no. yeah. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. The witch lady is in nine. No, the wit the tall witch lady. The tall witch lady. Now I'm getting confused. This is why I don't no. like talking about Final Fantasy because it's so confusing. No, the witch lady is eight, and I wish I could give you her name to help you. I wish you could too. Again, I liked nine better. Anyway, than the end of the first <laughs> disc is the parade, and I'm pretty sure disc two begins with the fight against the witch at the parade. Okay. And. I, uh, so I came to these games late, but I was still an idiot child, and it's more that I nobody like came to me and said, "Oh, you rotate your saves in Final Fantasy because you have no idea what could be around the corner, and True. you might screw yourself if you only have one save." And so, like, I was just not ready to fight that boss. Oh. Like I just was ill You're prepared. Severely under leveled. I, right. I like I didn't have anything I needed to achieve success in that encounter. It was just not going to happen. Oh no. Um, and I was just like, all right, I'm good. Um. All right. For seven, I forget why I stopped, but I know I stopped like literally in the Shinra building, which I okay. think is the end of disc one for that game too. Don't ask me. Like, yeah, I, I don't remember. I know that I played them. Don't ask like me. Like when we went back, when we, when we played Final Fantasy VII R, mm -hmm. I remembered everything that, well, everything that happened in the Shinra building originally. Right. Um, Like as it happened in R, like the blood trail yeah, and all that stuff. Like, like I remember that. But unlocked I, a memory within your But like literally right brain. after that, I was like, no, like, I mean, I don't remember a minute of what happens after that. So that's probably where I stopped there, too. Nine, I made it even less far. Crazy. That one's the, arguably the best. One. I like the night guy in, in nine. Um, night guy? He's like the main. Oh, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. You, I mean, he's obviously, cool. obviously, if you know Steiner? me at all, you, Steiner, yeah. right. Steiner. If you know me at all, you would know this. Like, ah, you probably do like Steiner. Um, mm -hmm. Also, did you place a world there, or can we go there? Okay, we can I go there. I literally placed the Tree of Mana, the coolest thing, and he was talking through it. It's fine. We're going <laughs> we're there now. We're not going there. Okay. We're not See, going we're there. not even going It again. needs to be placed to trigger this event, though. Okay. Um, 
And it's funny because, like, as I was watching that animation of mm-hmm. the monetary, like, bursting onto the scene, it reminds me of the exact place where my Final Fantasy VII... Wait, that's you. That's you. That's me. That's... Wait, you're there. That's not good. It's a doppelganger. Um, kill that. Maybe. <laughs> um, what if you're the clone? You interrupted my story. Rick and Morty, you're the clone. You're interrupting my story. Go, you yeah, tell the you story. Got to go. Tell the story, and now it's my no, turn. No, go. I just, I was not expecting to see a clone of your character. <laughs> go. It's part of the event. Um, the whole animation reminds me of the place where my disc four stops in the Sephiroth fight. Mm-hmm. There's like all of this like crazy like like clouds and stuff happening, and I just remember every time the PlayStation could not get past it. It was like when you see all those effects on a stream and it just makes the stream freak out that's exactly what would happen every single time and i could not get it to work it would never blow past it i feel like i was convinced that like sephiroth was too powerful for my ps1 too powerful for your ps1 i feel like that's when you make a quick run to blockbuster and you're like i need a final fantasy 7 real quick i think it was the disc reader not the disc yeah, like, and I remember I used like a little spinny thing to clean it, and I think it was scratched. Yeah, which is really sad. But it happens when you're a kid and you don't take care of your stuff. So, yeah, my fault. Oops. Anyway, so uh, we're in town now, and uh, there we are over there. But we're over here, but we're also over there, um, and we're threatening the Sproutling. We're gonna take his leaves because you know apparently their leaves are very powerful for tea or something. Kill her. And Don't let her leave. There I go. Blast her. <laughs> we definitely just saw double. Oh my god. Sprawling, are you okay? <sighs> Don't pick anymore. Okay, bye. Yeah, go. We gotta get after that. <laughs> if you see a clone of yourself, kill it instantly. If you lose track of it, who but knows who's what it's the gonna clone? do. Are you the clone? Oops. That's, that's the wrong path. Wait, that's where she went, though. No, 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 but we're going this way first. Hello? Yeah, that was what he said last time. Um, there's the church that we've never actually been to. St. Mana Church. I'm yep. sure that is for later. It just feels like a later game area. Not necessarily. And she is taking more leaves. That's so rude. <laughs> okay. Swear to God, it wasn't me, dude. No! no. <laughs> Don't let my leaves! <laughs> okay. There's a witness over there. We have to kill her, too. Oops. Nope. Didn't mean to go back. Okay. Now we gotta go talk to somebody, one of our old friends. I know you're hoarding pumpkins, Teapot. Hand them over. Dwell, what's got into you? This ain't like you at all. Shut up! I'm Shut gonna, up! Shut up! I'm gonna use the pumpkin men to take over the world! Why are you saying such things? Hand them over, or else. Or else what? Speak up, you silly onion. Can't threaten me. I ain't afraid of you. What else on your back? What about my back? <laughs> on your back, I'll make an anthill! What? <laughs> that sounds truly awful, to be honest. I'll get so itchy with an anthill on your back. I love when she cries. <laughs> Just water everywhere. Blech. Blech. <laughs> yep. <laughs> okay. Uh, she gave all the pumpkins over. So is it like a shapeshifter type situation? Uh, perhaps. Okay. Stop her. Like what? You'll that see. is a You'll that see. is a pet peeve of mine. Why? When like a villain is clearly on screen and you're like, you know, you could take them, but the game spoiler. just doesn't let you. Like that is a pet peeve of mine. Ew, green goop. I mean. You're gonna be able to take them. Don't worry. Of course, but again, from a hey, as someone who runs a D and D campaign, you can't just have your villain within like weapons length of the party and not expect them to attack it. Like it's just it doesn't work that way. Right. They will always attack it. We're just trying to see what's up, man. I'm just trying to see what's up, and also like 
trying not to alert everybody that this person looks like us. Because then everybody's going to attack us. So we have to be sneaky. So you picking on Spratlings. Bad hero. Bad hero. <laughs> I didn't mean to. Back to Pumpkinville. Come at the perfect time. To See, dance. like, it bums me out that, like, she doesn't have, like, a bizarro portrait, even. Like, uh, of, like, her, she looks, you know, like you found her out. It bums me out. I just didn't think they thought of it that way. They wanted to. Dude, exactly it would be like so you. cool if you could see like the evil version of your character fighting this them is as a doll. Evil version. Right, but like, like. I hate you. But like, as a portrait. I'm your dark side. Yeah, that's. They it. couldn't even side. be bothered to draw a dark side version of your character. I don't understand why I'm your dark side. It's like I can't help feeling sorrow, but I don't know. I feel like I've lost confidence in myself this last. Yeah, time your days. facial expression really evinces that. Look, because it's not actually her dark side. Uh huh. It's just a shapeshifter. So that's why there's no dark portrait of her. Because it's just a dude who can take shape. Whatever, kill that thing. Oh. <laughs> He's so tiny. I love his little dive I kick. Know. Get him, Doug. Get him, Doug. I want to see that animation again. A little karate chop. No, oh. no, I want to see his dive kick. Oh, I don't think he's gonna do it. Gotcha. Yeah! yeah. Kung Lao dive kick. <laughs> he's very adept. He's got a black belt. Oh no, he punched Doug to death. Doug, no! Oh no, Doug actually no. Did, did some damage here, so I'm happy. Mm -hmm. Oh, ow. Dude. Get him. Try, sir. He's so little. I know, he's very fast. Oh, come on. We're dancing. Oh. Oh. I don't know if he has any, like, okay, instant stun. Cool. I have a question. I don't know if you know the answer. Does Japan do jack o' lanterns? Because they're, yeah, so. they're certainly in everything Japanese that yeah. involves Halloween, even a little bit. I'm not sure they do Halloween in the same way that we do, but I like think. Like trick or treating, probably not. Yeah, I don't. They don't. They have, like, a version where kids do dress up. Or maybe they like thank the spirits or something, but it's not the same as the way that we do it here. Mm -hmm. I don't think it's on like All Hallows Eve, um, but they definitely like the jack o' lantern like aesthetic. aesthetic oh yeah, because it's like it's in everything. Mm -hmm. I like jack o' lanterns; they're pretty cool. Who doesn't? <laughs> Pumpkins impersonating people. Pumpkin patches. <gasps> Tipo, do you have any idea what went on? No. No. Tipo. It wasn't me. It was a phony. <laughs> Where is Duel? Is he just hanging out on the highway or something? He's gonna come back into town and be like, Is that that whole quest, by the way? We never, yeah. like, that's it? That was that's the whole. It. Now you know that there's creatures out there that could impersonate you for okay. evil deeds, though. Did he come out of the mana tree portal? Uh, maybe, 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 maybe it's possible. Cause I think that quest only um, triggers when you place this. Like you have to have yeah. had this artifact after that last one and placed it. If you keep it, I don't think it triggers. Oh boy, do we have all these things? I think we do. <laughs> the next quest requires uh, some stuff. Some stuff. Okay. That's okay. I think we have all that though. Oh me, Doug. Okay. Oh. Ugh, so many repeats. I wish I could grow something cool. I think. I'm not sure when I'm supposed to plant the golden seed. I don't think, like... Wait, do we have the golden seed? We do. The artifact. Um, oh. I don't think that it, like, it will affect quests or anything, but I'll have to look into that, because it's, like, it's basically a second garden. Oh, good. Thank yeah. God. <laughs> but, um, 
I don't want to accidentally plant it in like the wrong place. Mm -hmm. or maybe you don't even plant it till next time. I'm not sure. I don't remember. But it's helpful for obviously getting seeds and stuff. Mm -hmm. Also, I don't know why squalfins take so long to grow. It's possible because we haven't completed like all of the elements around home yet. Uh, yeah, that might be what yeah, influences it. That guy is just like chilling there as a bud. Give me the seeds. Give me the seeds. Spiny seed? Spiny seed? No. Uh, he hates me. Have very many seeds to give him right now, so we'll just leave. Bye bye. Okay. Um, I'm gonna go inside. Oh, oh. oh my goodness. Just karate chopping my uh, desk here. Talk, talk, talk. Ant Hill, itchy. It's true. Swear, he takes the most arbitrary details from my stories. <laughs> okay, we are going to. Do, 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 do. do I get to play yet or nah? No, not yet. This one's another talk and give quest, but it's super love quick. talk and gives. Super quick. Oops, oops. I'm gonna be so upset if I don't have everything. I should though. Like, yeah, we're back again. Okay, seems we have a lot of business in Domino lately. So we're gonna go talk to Miss Yuka at the inn, mm -hmm. who's right there. Cool. Hello. I asked Mei Mei, who's the grape lady. Um, in the next area over. She tells your fortune. Um, uh -huh. Ask Mei Mei to spin her fruit and find out what Peewee needs. Peewee's that little dude over there. Yep. She told me Menos Bronze, Baobab Wood, Animal High, Topo Cod, a Flat Seed, Citrus Squid, Rotten Meat, and Sulfur. Please help me find them. Do we have... Oh wait, you did buy Extra Sulfur. I bought Extra Sulfur. You bought Extra Sulfur. Yep. That was the move. Da -da 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 -da. It's better not be her telling me that I don't have it. Are you kidding me? Do I, mm. I feel like you have all those things, I but know. maybe you have to leave and come back. Maybe. Just because maybe. it assumes that you don't. Yeah. Let me see. Baba Wood, we have. And what was the next thing? Hold on, hold on. Uh huh. Really wish you could like search your menus because they are very annoying. Nope. No. Nope. We have a rotten meat. Yep. Um, we have the baobab wood. Mm -hmm. We should have the sulfur right there. We have a wad of wool. We don't have any topple cotton. Are you joking me? What's topple cotton? I don't know. <laughs> it's just cotton. We do have the animal hide. We have the menace brown. So we need. And I know we have citrus squids at the butt. Um, so we need that topple cotton. There. Topple cotton. And we have the flat seed. And it doesn't does it tell you in your handy dandy guide where to get a topple cotton. No. Um, topple cotton. Okay. Let me go see. Maybe uh, she's weapons. I don't think anybody sells items in here. Let's go see if we can find some. I feel like somebody sells some somewhere. Do you want me to just look it up? Sure, if you want. I'm just going to Google the word topple cotton and see just what happens. Google topple cotton legend of mana. <laughs> Let's see. Who's Let's find out just so we stuff? have the thing. No, I don't think it's there. Oh, if only Geo were open. I wonder if anybody sells anything fun over here. Topple cotton legend of mana. I think it's a drop. I'm not sure that Where to find topple it. cotton? <laughs> oh, yeah. You know, it's one of those good... <laughs> Is it one of those? Um... I won't even read the name of the website that has this article. Okay. It's, it's stupid. Um, <laughs> yep. Yep. Where to find topple cotton? Uh... 
all second this floor stuff. of Domina's in the very end that she's in really? he just has it really yeah interesting I thought it was a drop for sure nope mm. apparently not do, 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 do. okay well I bought some seeds from this ge gentleman right here so that was cool let's go get that top of cotton who has it? Just somebody up there? The Literally in the second floor of the inn, there's a merchant that just sells you the topple cotton. Oh, yeah, there is that guy up there, huh? He's just, he just lives there. There were about a thousand words in that article, by the way, that I looked up before that, just so we're clear. <laughs> I hate the internet now. Yeah, everything's a clickbait. Eventually, somebody will search for topple cotton and they'll get that precious click. <laughs> Dude. All right, well, at least it's here. And I also got some seeds in the meantime. It makes it feel better. Let's see. This guy? Apparently. Hey, what's up, dude? Okay. Hey! Okay. Stupid. <laughs> Very stupid. Well, let's buy one of these. And one of these. <sighs> Why not? Cool. Well, now we can complete the quest. Oh. Mm. Just ran right in there. All right. Oh! You did the thing. Or she's gonna name them all off again. Let me have them, please. Sure. Oh, thank you. You saved my little peewee. Um, something interesting to note about this quest is... You get no reward from it? No. Okay. I could have talked to Pee-wee and gotten a revivering. I don't really need that. Um, because we're good. But yeah. if you talk to him too much, uh, he will explode and you'll fail the event. <laughs> <laughs> okay. And I think I've tested that before and he does, in fact, explode. <laughs> it's really sad. Why, w why would he explode? I don't know. <laughs> because the developers of this game have a very strange sense of humor. Like, it's so weird. Why would he explode? I don't know. Because I guess Meme said that he was in great danger if he didn't get that stuff. And he would just explode? Yeah. Here's a fun thing you probably didn't know about Warcraft 2. Uh, Go for it. This is important. <laughs> this is apropos. Mm -hmm. Um... There's a weird, it's not really even like an Easter egg, it's just game knowledge. Mm -hmm. uh, wildlife in Warcraft 2, so like sheep, goats, goats. like <laughs> animals in the way. Yeah. I believe if you click on them 20 times, 20? it's an arbitrary number, but yeah. it is a consistent one. They just detonate into gore. Okay. Um, exactly. It just reminded me of that specifically. Uh, <laughs> there's even a like a, a map. Um, there's a map in Warcraft 2 that you could pick that was literally you had one peon and uh -huh. you were just surrounded by sheep in all directions. And it just became like you had to click faster than your opponent to make enough room to start playing the game. OK. That's Very stupid. So weird. It's very weird. It's weird that there's another game where that's like a thing that you can do. Mm -hmm. But anyway. Huh. Why why is it in there like that? Dude, I have no idea. <laughs> no <Because>. clue. <laughs> okay. So cool. Now I know where to go get seeds from that guy. They're pretty cheap too, so you know. Ooh. Okay, now you will get to help me. <laughs> Not trying to leave you out on purpose, I promise. No, you're fine. We're just getting rid of, getting Play the game. Out of the I way. will assist when it's my turn to assist. We land next, too. Yay. Ooh, and we get to place the golden seed. Cool. Okay. Incredible timing. Sounds good to me. Right. Let's go, bud. That's you. That's me. Yes. I will pick up the controller Wicked now. spells, by the way. His dialogue changed because we um, found all the wisdoms. Found all the wisdoms. I don't know if his actual spells did change, by the way. Nah. And now just, it's he's just, just Bud talking himself up. More excited to do it. Yeah. Um, let me do something really quick. Let him graze. Oh. 
they're gaining levels on each other. Cool. Well, when your pets are here, they don't gain levels, but I think I'm gonna drop Doug in a little bit so that he can eat a food and then take him eventually. I don't think petting does anything either. There's no, like, friendship or, like, gauge with your pets. Not a thing in this. No. No, 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 no. <laughs> they didn't get that far with the pet, like, mechanic. Hey, there's so many different things you can do at home <laughs> that it's like, ah, whatever. Yeah. If they're all a little, um... They're all a little unpolished, in my yeah. opinion. Yeah, but just not that deep. Yeah. The cra Which, again, the crafting is like overly so. Deep. Yeah, like there's somehow more focus. If there was a like like a heart meter for your pet, that would be so cool. Uh huh. Like I think that would have been just that extra little cherry on top for that. Uh, directly to the left. Boom. What is it? We've had this for like hours, right? That's the for anchor. A while, yeah. Yeah. It's another town. Yay. Polpata Harbor. Mm -hmm. Oh, we get to place two? Yeah, I said we get to place the golden sword. Right, sword. okay, I forgot that. Yep. Uh huh. You already forgot. I forgot it. <laughs> is it to the left? To the right. Boop. Okay. You Okay. Oh, we're placing a third, too. What? What? Thing? That's almost all of our artifacts. Look at the tree up there. It's going nuts. It is going nuts. Yeah. I think we don't have too many more lands to place. It might be... Well, yeah, the tree's pretty much yeah, in full bloom. Yeah, it might be these balloon. two plus a couple more artifacts, and mm -hmm. then we're kind of done. Um, directly above the lake. <laughs> Hey y'all, oh. we're going to the beach. Let's go. Destiny Islands. <laughs> I really like the beach. It's really pretty. Um, the music is fun too. I'm trying to count. I think we have three more artifacts that we get. That's it? Okay, and then we're, we're just four. walking back yeah. between the lands, okay. Mm -hmm. All right, so welcome to the penguin arc. Okay. Time to penguin. Uh, Love to penguin. Valerie and her lover, husband, man partner in crime yeah david valerie and david cute so he's got to go to the ship and she has to stay behind should have never fallen in love with a pirate yar <laughs> yeah david the pirate <laughs> oh she has a flower so cute so... where does she have a flower it was in her portrait mm. yeah it is yeah Oh, yeah, it is. Okay. It's so cute. Or <laughs> What is it? She has something to tell him. Never mind. You should get going. I'll hatch it myself. <gasps> She's gonna have a baby. <laughs> okay, and so they slide away. We're gonna try to do this. What are we step what are you doing? On twenty crabs. Can I help? Uh Oh god, come back, come back. Oh. Okay. So during this event, we have to try and step on 20 crabs. Okay. Um, to trigger a later event. I think that was like four. Okay. I don't know if you can help, but like, I literally don't These know. These don't count works. though? Like as kills? No, 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 no. You gotta crush like. You gotta crush those other guys. The non hostile crabs. Tiny enemy crabs. Yeah, they're crunchy crabs. Wow, we walk like two feet. I know. Hey. Ooh. Ooh, he tried, dude. Tried to get me. God, you got so much experience. <laughs> Blood doesn't play around. It's true. The more buff you can make him for me for the next time, it'd be great. Oh, Come back okay. here. Yeah, drifted to my We're good. to my hit. <laughs> nice. Okay. Um, I'm 
so scared. Oh, okay. Oh, oh god. I can't help you. Yeah, I know. Oh, you... Oh, you bastard. Yeah, that was a <laughs> decent amount. The only the one got away, so hopefully it adds up to 20. Uh, okay, cool. Hold on. Just want to make sure we're going the right way. Haven't we been exactly here before? Kinda, yeah, they do reuse this for the other cave, which is annoying. I think they added a little bit of like coral stuff to the background. Maybe, maybe not. Yeah. But what are you gonna do? I know. <laughs> Again, two feet. Yeah. Another encounter. Oh, interrupted. Get that charge up. There we go. Are they dead? No. Almost. Almost dead. Yeah, that was good. Ooh, all spoils. Nice. <laughs> uh, can't go that way. I like this guy. Oh. Get him! Okay. Morph meat. Mm -hmm. No idea what properties most of the meats have. I just feed them. Oh god. Go go go. Nice. Slow boy. Go. One oh, two. Uh, one stuck, got away. Me. That guy stuck though. Yeah. I think that's pretty close to twenty. Not gonna lie. I think we have to go this way. Upper left. I don't know why we're doing that, but to activate an event later. Which. Oh my god missable if you don't do it so and you just have to do it on your first time through like you can't what do you mean like if we left the environment and came back would the crabs come back uh no i don't think so it's during this specific event that you have to do it they do come back later if you like completely leave the environment but ah. if you don't do it during this event you're you're done like it won't activate that next event I kind of have a lot of health too now as Bud. Yeah, like, you keep leveling up. I'm pretty close to you. Yeah. Like one crystal for you is 42 experience. That's <laughs> over here. Seems like a lot. Level. Yeah. Gotcha. Mm -hmm. I will continue nice. to hammer on the triangle button. I nice shared experience with you there too. Come on. I'm coming. Please come. I'm coming. <laughs> oh. Go, go, go. I'm going. I'm going. Go, go. go. Oh. Oh. Pick one. Oh, I can't. Ah! Maybe you got 20 already. Please. I'm really trying. He's. Uh oh. That was Shoot. a. That was a big whiff. What are you? What are you trying to say? A big whiff. Yes. Oh, you're good. Are you shadow in training? By the way, that number doesn't include me. Is that, that mean? So what did that do? He just tells you how many you got. That doesn't do anything. It's but just that's your not the event. It's not the event. Okay, but it does mean we're good. Yes, we are good. That we is good. a good thing. <laughs> I do think they do respawn um, if you come back later. But uh -huh. again, it has to be during this event, or else you're just locked out. Which is kind of mean, but. I wonder what happens if you somehow get them all. I feel like it's not possible to get them all. Oh god, this guy's chonky large. I will press triangle now. He is a little Watch boy. this. Mm, let's see if I can fit a move in there. Get him. Okay. Nice. Oh god! Nice. That was awesome. And he's dead. All <laughs> right. Bud cooks now. Jesus. Yeah. Here, wait, let us get the experience, please. Please. I can't move. I literally. Okay. <laughs> 450. With one crystal? Yes, uh, because you're on your own. I'm splitting it between everybody. And I think it's actually sharing some of ours with you, too. So. Yeah, you said last time it doesn't, but it, it certainly it feels did. like it well, does. Well, it did because I, I looked 
Um, and even though I took all of them, you got 50. So I think it shares with everybody in the party. So please stop stealing my experience. <laughs> but is Beth, though. Oh, they're gonna be together forever. You must go back to your ship. <laughs> Valerie, if I quit being a pirate, we can be together. My heart said I'm giving it all up for ye. 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 Go back to your ship. <laughs> you used to talk about how you wanted to see the world. Don't you remember saying that when we were kids? I, I remember. I was too young to know any better. Man, if there's one, like, <laughs> historical uh, career I would never pursue, it's being a sailor. That sounds awful. I thought you were going to say piratism, but... I mean, pirate is, like, dark <laughs> sailor. sailor. Yeah, like, bad sailor, but... Contract sailor. Sea monster treasure sailor. It's like, you bit up all the monsters, so they won't attack your dear Val. Said those things, but you said something about an egg. Yeah, let's talk about laying an egg sometime in the future. Oh. Alright, silly. I'm only dreaming about having an egg. Oh, I'm gonna hate you if you don't go. Back to your ship. Aww. Bye. Later. I'll come back to you. <laughs> oh god. In ten years time, that's so long. Hundred years is even longer. I'm back as a captain with a hundred penguins under me wing. Don't forget this. It's a vow, Val. <laughs> it's a vow, Val. That's so hard. <laughs> so long, me love. Bye. David. <sighs> David. I just don't think I can live with a pirate. Hatch the egg myself. That's what's best. That's kind of mean. Ooh, platinum's nice, though. Thanks. And that's just the end of that quest. Just the end. Hey. Mer. Mer. Stony crab. Pixar crab. <laughs> he really is, though. Okay, 22. That's really good. I got really scared. But that did something. That will unlock an event for next time, whenever. Okay. Um, so, mm -hmm. I think we do see them again. Um, it is a small penguin arc. So I'm pretty sure that we get to go hang out with them okay. one more time. Yay. Now we're back to the Jimmy arc after this. I don't I don't remember who Jimmy is. Um who? Who they are. <laughs> Hello, sir, please move. <laughs> Here, let's take the bud. And then I'll go do my chores. I'll make I will put my controller down. <laughs> Rest your little fingies. Um, so the Jimmy are like Rubens, all those guys. Pearl, Elizul. Oh. Yeah. They okay. have a pretty big overarching yeah, like the plot. Yeah. Gemstone guys. Yeah. Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, right, right, right. Crab bashing. Crab bashing. Speaking of crab bashing. It's weird that the, in that last quest, the game um, that I saw didn't do anything to tell you that that was the main point of what you were doing there. You're not supposed to know into like it's really supposed to be you are like why can i crush these crabs and then you either choose to be an asshole or not and you run over all the crabs and or you just decide to go on with the quest uh-huh yeah like not having a guide um and not having a guide for that i'm pretty sure i just like stopped on what i could but i didn't realize Till you go all the way left uh -huh. to that cave and you meet that other crab that he was counting for you. So that's where they kind of tell you like, oh, this was important. And you're like, oh, great. Of course, they don't tell you that it's for a quest. They're just like, hey, this is your number. But you'll figure it out eventually. Mm -hmm. You know, that's the whole point of what you were doing. Yeah. So it's a missable quest, that one. It's not like super plot important, I don't think. It's just it's just a silly side quest. Have we missed any quests yet? Nope. Okay. As I far as I so. know, nope. Which is definitely the goal, is to not miss any quests. But I'm not like I said, I'm not sure if you 
like can get all those crabs because we're on auto run right now and well you missed uh, what are there th probably 30 in total I think there's 30. yeah, yeah 26 maybe. maybe yeah something like because you missed more. you missed three before your blunder in the last room where i think you missed like three, three. but i don't know yeah. it feels like such a weird number yeah so it might be 28 30. but yeah, yeah it might i don't be know 30. but like i just don't think it's physically possible to get all of those crabs even on auto run like i didn't feel like i ran around too much mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. let's give you that and i'll give you one of these okay are there um are there quests that are new game plus specific no okay that's surprising to me actually yeah um it's kind of weird they just like front loaded everything to be possible but i feel like that is also a good choice for them to have made because not everybody is going to want to play new game plus just surprised there's not like anything like move move yeah ah oh, god this Sir, sucks get out of my this way. sucks move <laughs> it's weird that you can't walk through these guys but you can walk through other people mm -hmm. like during quests um i'm gonna go check out our new garden the orchard Oh yeah, we haven't even walked here yet. Mm -mm. Does this guy grow things differently or is it just yet more? It's just another tree, man. Cool. Uh... <laughs> it's literally a clone. He's like, hey, what's up? <sighs> hello, hello. Oh, he moves. Goodness it's exactly the, the same. Met. It couldn't have even been like an autumn theme or something here. Like that's too much to ask. It was 1999 when this game came out. What about out. like a like a snowy tree garden or something? That would be no. Sick. I would love that. Nope. Trent regained the monoflow because of you. Yes, yes, I know this. This is all of us plants have the deepest connection with each other. I have much to thank you for. Because of you, I exist here now. Cool. Send my thanks to you, the one blessed by Mona. Cool. All right, here, take my. Does seat. this guy grow anything differently? No. As far as I know, no. It's just you're now spreading your chances around uh -huh. to um, just grow more stuff and get more seeds from them. Cool. Um, sure is. Here you go. Sure be do. All right, later, tree guy. He is surrounded by, like, everything, though. Like, let's look at it on the big map. So this guy should grow, like, extremely good fruit. He should definitely, um, yeah, look at that. He's full. Aha. Uh -huh. On all okay, of Okay, so this should just be a there. straight up better orchard. For now, yeah, because look, we're like totally lacking in shade and undine down here, but we do have a space right here that's not full, so we're kind mm. of uh, sad. But, and he's also closer to the monetary right there, so. Yeah. Yeah. That makes sense. Yeah. That's okay. We'll see what happens um, after this. This is another, this is a lore quest. Um, has to do with the soldier that we fought at the beginning of the Bone Fortress. So. Yeah, I definitely remember that. He, remember he like cut through the world. Oh he, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Subtle yeah. knife guy. Mm -hmm. And he like kind of loaded in body piece by body piece. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, I recall. So this is Pol Pot of Harbor. Yay. I think this guy sells stuff. What do you sell? Yes. What you got? What you got? Silver. Hey, buys her gold. Nice. Judd him. Did we need holy water for something? Buy one. You have infinite money. Worst case, you don't need it. I think we need a holy water for something. Go ahead. For our sword. Um, oh, it's a fabric. Uh, let's buy one of these. Buy another gold. And a one more silver. Oh, thanks, mm -hmm. dude. Uh, I think we have to talk to the fireling. I heard that people don't feel safe at the seaside hotel anymore. Because of a ghost? Because of a thief, maybe? No, no, it's because of a ghost. How scary. Mermaid. Hi. She's very cute. I love she her. She ain't afraid of no ghost. There's no ghost. Flamache! This ghost talk is just someone pulling a prank. I'm Flamiche, the mermaid. As you can see, pleased to meet you. I don't think she's pleased to meet us, though. 
My ghost is just somebody playing a trick. I can't believe everyone is getting so worked up over it. She has attitude. I love her. Um, does he sell anything? Oh, okay. Head over to the hotel in the middle of town. Maybe you'll see the ghost. Maybe you'll see a ghost! <laughs> Welcome to my flower shop. Everything's free until you buy something. I love the smell of the ocean. Too bad the salt air makes my hair sticky. Alright, dude, are you gonna sell me anything or not? Is there anybody up here? Yes, this guy up here is actually selling stuff. Oh. Should we get a spear? Sure. Yeah. It's just better, right? It's just better. It might have some, like, properties that are slightly better, but who wants to that? You right. might as well. You got so much money. <laughs> it's made of gold. Even though, like, again, gold not actually a great weapon, like, metal to fight it's with. It's yeah. It's actually, like, probably one of the worst. It's soft. It's mushy. Yeah, but apparently gold has different properties in this world. Okay. Okay. It's cool that thanks to Minecraft, everyone knows that now. Yeah, like, I was just thinking that. Thanks, Minecraft. <laughs> oh, nothing. Talk to this Mr. Multi, sir. Welcome to the Seaside Hotel. Our security is top notch. Inspector Boyd is on patrol. Oh great. I feel like Boyd is hurting you. Oh God, did you, did you see that? I heard it. He was right there at the stairs. Ah, I can't take it anymore. Do you know anyone who's not scared of ghosts? I can help. Make it worth your while. Drown dreams. You're welcome. So this is weird, like... Oh, that, I didn't even see that that was right. an exit. Yeah. Oh, shoot. Didn't make it so. There he is. Oh, there he is. Yep. Hello, Inspector. Think... Okay. Wait, we're not talking to the inspector, or? Not yet. I think we have to go talk to okay. some other people. Okay. There's a restaurant down here. I would work here if I lived here. Hello. They could use a couple more tables, I think. I agree. So there's some pirates here. Oh, look who else is here. It's Gilbert. Monique, my broken heart is You paid. broke up with her. I know. I have a feeling that a new love is about to begin. No, sir. Go to the beach and talk. Would you date a centaur man? I don't think so. Yeah. I feel like there's a lot you gotta contend with. Yeah, I agree. See, there's stairs here, but you can't go down. It's so weird, because they're in the water. <laughs> I just want to go. So, that's not where the beach is, but we have to go to the beach. Okay. It's kind of a big map with nothing to Going do. on. Yeah, there's yeah. Like nowhere to go. Uh -huh. Almost as if maybe they planned for like more to happen. Wow. <laughs> but it just didn't. It just doesn't. Yeah. I feel like some elements, like there's that whole area over there that you just can't You go never go to. up there. You can't get to it. And mm. it's, I really do think like there are some parts of this game that they had in development and then they just had to cut them which is really sad yeah yeah hmm yeah i've always wanted to go up there but i can't can I go no, I can go there. hello sir i am toma imperial soldier that guy's cool yeah kind of am i gonna be that guy ever no. it's just strictly lore <laughs> i'm investigating the imperial ship that sank 10 days ago what is it uh, Ask about ghost? the ghost! I wonder about the ghost to myself. He doesn't care that there's a ghost. He knows there's a ghost. He fully acknowledges the ghost. Uh, what happened to the ship? Uh, I was heading to this port on the Emperor's secret orders. Uh, what Emperor? He's being pretty flippant with classified information with you, I guess. Right. Like, you just met me, dude. <laughs> the weather was fair, yet it still sank. It truly is a mystery. Can't get out of that. No. It's also a weird lack of like canceling, canceling dialogue uh -huh. in this game. It's very strange. Did was, talking like, to oh, him do anything or? Uh, yeah, it's moving the story along. So sure. Like he said, he's investigating that ship sinking. Um. Go back to the hotel. It's just kind of a let's run around the map quest. So there's this. 
basket fish. Mm -hmm. He's a fish in a basket. Sure. Don't get fresh with me. I'm not like you commoners. I'm not trying to. Seen the ghost? <laughs> Y'all seen the ghost? <laughs> Go away. I don't like beggars. He's very classist. Shoo shoo. What? Okay. Wow. wow. Why, it's Mr. Fish. It's Mr. Fish. <laughs> uh, Ravanche is a dancer. And her dancing is better than before. I'll rent the whole hall. Here's 50 G's. Thank you very much. Goodbye, dude. Weirdo. <sighs> Lost all our customers since the ghost came. We have to take his money. Novo Rich Fish. Novo Rich Fish. <laughs> <laughs> business is business. Hey, you know what? Get that money, dudes. Okay, now we gotta go talk Warm. to Boyd. Boyd is just hanging out over here. Not really Just like, patrolling the dock. Yeah, just the dock. Inspector Boyd on duty. Okay. Any news? Why are you asking me? Ask about the ghost. <laughs> um, okay, so Basketfish collected inheritance and is kind of going around. Well, that's very gauche of him. I know. <laughs> going around spending all his money willy nilly. <laughs> if the weather was clear, maybe the boat sprang a leak. The ship. It was not a mere boat, it was a ship. The one who haunts the seaside hotel? What nonsense! Okay. Well, you sure are thorough. Quite impressive. Is there anything else? What about you? How are you doing, Inspector Boyd? <laughs> Do you suspect me? Well, no. I actually came here on assignment. Just asking. Right? How you doing, man? Jewel Hunter left a note. Said she'd steal the blue eye. If you see anyone with blue eyes, report to me immediately. Okay. Okay. Is Revache, is that her name? Revache? Revanche? Revanche? Is she the blue eyed gal? I'm not sure, actually. I don't remember. <laughs> okay. We have to go back to the restaurant. Ugh. Wow. I'm doing a lot of running around today. Oh, wait. That's that one. Yeah, this is probably the most incomplete, like, town map in yeah. this game because there's only one way to get to places every place yeah at least in domino you can like go around but here they're like nah you gotta keep tracking okay mm. okay this guy doesn't say anything How about this guy yep we know that you guys are privateers what is a privateer versus a pirate is a privateer a nicer word for pirate uh, again, I made the they're like contract sailors joke about pirates earlier, but a privateer is actually more like a contract sailor. They okay. don't really work for anybody. They just have boat. We have boat. Okay. Gotcha. Would you like to put something on boat? <laughs> Does he have to walk away? Oh, no. Soldier? Okay. I think you can give him any answer. He just is like, whatever doesn't really affect the event, luckily. Okay, here we go. We did it. Mm -hmm. I am Toma, Imperial Soldier. <laughs> Do you have any information regarding the shipwreck? Underestimate the sea at your own risk. <laughs> right, right. I love these penguins, they're cute. Maybe correct. Yeah, I mean, they're not wrong. There be a guy that goes by the name Basketfish. Basketfish. Yes, there sure, sure do be. So he sees everything that happens under the waves. Basket, what? Usually be at the Seaside Hotel drooling over that dancer. Thanks, I will take a look. He walks kind of like, Later. weird. <laughs> it's all the armor that he's wearing. Okay. Let's go to the hotel. <laughs> okay, outside. What a stupid name, Basketfish. Stop, stop, stop. I'm with the police. Here's my police card. <laughs> Inspector Boyd, quote unquote. I've discovered a clue connecting the Imperial ship and the Hotel Ghost. Imperial ship and the ghost? The ghost? That was weird. Is a ghost that's just ghost out of my ear. <gasps> that's strange. 
What do you say? Will you cooperate with my investigation? Certainly. Thank you, Mr. What was your name? Toma. Mr. Imperial Soldier to you. Let's go. Walk, walk, walk. Doug's like, let's go. Okay, now we get to go to the left. I'm gonna watch this whole scene play out. It's very weird. I'm busy. I'm busy right now. Hey. I'm Toma of the Imperial Army. We know that, dude. Do you know anything about the shipwreck? I don't know anything. Leave me alone. <laughs> he paid a lot of money to have this place to himself. I agree. Like, Which, if I was the dancer, that would weird me out a little bit. Flattering, but weird. It is weird. I think she... They said that she hates him, but... Mm. Yeah. I mean, he's still a paying customer, right? So they're kind of like bothering him. Wahaha, I am not evil. <laughs> I also heard you inherited an incredible jewel. May I see it? Well, I don't know. It's called the Blue Eye, and it shows everything that happens in the ocean. I must see that jewel if I tell us how the ship. No. <laughs> Want to see the Blue Eye too? Okay. Ding. Ding. Uh-oh. Uh. Yo. Okay, so we're looking into the past. We're going to see the boat get sunk. Yeah. Just kind of Theoretically. Moving. Yeah. Uh, soldiers on the ship. Ba -da 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 -da. They, are, they were on their way to the harbor. Oh, boy. We have to use force if necessary. Back to your posts. So this is Captain Tona with an N. Uh-huh. Might be related to Toma. I don't know. Maybe. Maybe. So apparently a sea hag is on the way. Not a siren. Not a siren. Even though I'm pretty sure Sounds they mean like siren. siren. What? Hey, that looks like somebody uh. familiar. I think that's somebody that we know, actually. Oh no. Oh no. They fell asleep. And now they're dead. Oh, they crashed the boat. Dead? So Sea Hag sank it. It's terrible. Got it! <laughs> the truth as to our deaths, hand me the blue eye. It's really cool armor that this guy has. Alright, I'll give you the eye. Just don't curse me. Bye. Okay, bye, ghost. <laughs> it's terrifying. I didn't know ghosts could run. I have a question regarding your large inheritance. My inheritance is gone. What about the blue eye? Uh, the ghost came and took it away, Inspector. Ghosts aren't real. Get a grip. You walked right past I him. I know. Shuffled very quickly. Here, me. It's the jewel hunter again, dressed as a ghost this time. How do you dress as a ghost? Besides, you know, putting a sheet over your head. Yeah, I mean, Scooby-Doo kind of has that on lock. There's a lot of different ways to dress as a ghost, apparently. Monsters, though. Okay, we solved the ghost mystery? We did? I guess so. Did he just leave? Yep. Thanks. Okay. Thanks for the pirate hook. Ghost problems are now solved. Yep. Yeah, he's cool. And then we sit in silence. Yeah, 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 yeah. Look at our tree. It's so beautiful. I'm so happy. Go over here. Well, let's go over here. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Water time. We just got the hook, right? The hook's yep. new, yeah. I don't Arg. remember that one. Arg. Okay, go do some chores over here. Love to do chores. Love chores. Hopefully this one's gonna have, if not new <laughs> fruit, better fruit. Yeah, or at least they grew faster, maybe? Yeah, I mean, it has literally a three in every stat, so it yeah. should be like, okay, nothing new, awesome. Nothing new, but they did grow really fast, so. I mean, it also depends on the seeds that you give them, too, and I've kind of been spamming those three that I bought because those are the only ones that he was selling me uh -huh. from that area. Yeah. I don't know if anybody sells the basic seeds. They might. I might just. I mean, they them. probably figure that you can just get them from the tree. Right. Or that you can get them from um, battling. 
Eminis. That last one you threw in there is like the weirdest one because it's literally just... Just the Moai head? Yeah. Yeah. But like, it's not really like a play on anything. It just is that. Yeah. I don't know. Maybe they got tired by the end. <laughs> I don't know. How about a wonder of the world? That's fine. <laughs> Are the Moai wonders of the world? I'm not sure. Yeah, I don't know either. I think they're wonderful. They are wonderful of the... Well, I don't think that quite works. I don't know what it takes to... Like, the distinction on when something is classified as a wonder of the world, but... It's, yeah, it's not me. Like, Stonehenge that. is, right? I think so. Yeah. Grand Canyon, also, I right. think. I'm sure it's there's a the... comprehensive list. Is the Taj Mahal wonder of the world? I Probably. Think I think it is. Are there, aren't there like a bajillion wonders of the world or is it still seven? I feel like there's gotta be more. That's what I'm saying. I don't know when the classification yeah, who makes that decision on a wonder of the world. <laughs> I do declare. Giant yarn ball. Wonder of the world. <laughs> Are there any giant things around us that we should be visiting? Um. Because the giant yarn ball is a thing, but it's in the Midwest. Uh, <laughs> this is a really stupid answer to your really stupid question, yeah. but there is a, at an amusement park that is a couple hours away from us, there is a giant um, pillar of ice that is maintained year round. That seems incredibly environmentally unfriendly. People lick it? Ew, even it's, more so in in these times. Ugh. Yeah, I don't know about you know you tw twenty twenty. No, no, they. It, it has been ice for like decades. So how do you do that, dude? I, I don't know. I'm but disgusted and amazed. And yeah, people like go up time. and like lick it all day. Ew. And it's no like <laughs> it when I was shown it. I was like, so what do you do with it? And then I watched like a family of four go up and lick it. And I was like, this is like the Blarney Stone, but way worse, <laughs> like way worse. We've moved beyond kissing. It's like, what if it was just water, which is gonna hold bacteria even more than a rock will? Ew, uh, that's gross. What anyway, that was people? probably a too succinct answer to your stupid question. Nope. Because now I know. Now, now I know. you know. And I never want to go near it, ever. Don't. Nope. Do not. Although I do like the idea of it being being cordoned off throughout 2020. Yes. Like, do not lick, do not lick ice pillar. I agree. Don't do it. Do not taint the ice <laughs> pillar. It's so gross. It's so gross. What's wrong with people, dude? <laughs> we live in a world. We sure do. Okay. All right, we sure will. Okay. Woo. Um, you. Bud coming? Yeah. Bud time? It's bud time. It's bud time. Let's go, dude. Some wicked spells. Okay. And we're off again. Yep. Oh. Getting stuck. <laughs> we're gonna do some world running around okay. a bit in this one, but sounds too, good to me. Not too bad. So this is a follow-up to what we just saw. Mm-hmm. Um, I think our friend Monique is in trouble. That succubus lamp girl? She's not a succubus, she's a siren. She's okay. A siren. <laughs> I thought she literally she's... called herself a succubus. No, what? Nobody has called anybody a succubus. She's a siren. Okay. Uh oh, she's not here. Okay. So now we gotta go. Oh, we really want to try that new beer that Puzzlehead had for us, but looks like we got to save the world again. Okay. 
I'm getting stuck on everything. I know. Oh, okay. It's okay. Where the heck is the lamp shop? The houses are all empty. Who builds such a strange town? That's a great question. I know. Yeah, it's getting beyond a joke. <laughs> It's a really weird like translation. That is, I was just thinking that. That's a weird sentence for a person <laughs> yeah. to say, like even in this context. Mm -hmm. Okay, so they think that a mermaid, sea hag, whatever, siren. Uh, are they using all of those words interchangeably? Mermaid, kind of, sea yeah. hag, siren. I think that just goes to show that there's a lot of stories about different creatures mm -hmm. in the world. And some people are ignorant. Gotta catch someone or I'll never calm down. Where is the darn lamp shop anyway? I'm not gonna tell you. I wanna talk to this guy. You're he, stuck on him. There you go. Hey. You could tell he's a monster by the fact that he's just walking around with an axe. Yep. I'm Gurian, a very evil medicine goblin. Take me with you. I want to polish up on my evilness. No. It's pretty cool that you can just come get that guy. Is he just a random mm -hmm. party member? Yeah. Oops. Dumb. Does he have a quest, or is he just a random party he, member? He's just there. I, as far as I know, he doesn't have a quest that you need to come get him for. Okay. He might have, and he just got left in the game for some reason. Um, Cut content. Now I have to go back to the shop. <sighs> do, 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 do. Yeah, it really sucks. There's just not, <laughs> just so many unfinished like areas. Hey, sir. What are you doing here? Shopkeeper isn't here. It's an admission of guilt in my eyes. Really, dude? Like, okay. So. I don't know what she could possibly have to gain from sinking their ship, though. Right. Unless it's just, like, a fun thing sirens can't... Sirens? Sirens <laughs> can't help but do. I don't think so. Like, they just have to do it sometimes. I think that it might just be a weird byproduct of their singing, perhaps. I don't give us her fault. We really don't go to the mana tree yet, huh? Is that like the end of the game or something? Can you stop guessing? <laughs> I mean, you place it and don't go there. I don't know what... Yes, it's the end of the game. God. <laughs> Could we go there at any time? Yeah, but you'll break quests if you do that. Sure, I bet. You definitely don't want to do that. Beach, I think. Wait, hold on. Oh, the restaurant. Sorry, everybody. Long way. Yeah. All the way around. around. Downtown. Mm -hmm. <laughs> there she is. Hello. Hi. What's up, friend? Came to see my friend Elle, but I can't find her. Hey, some cops broke into your shop. There she is, the one who sank our ship. Oh God. Uh -huh. She's a siren, all right. It must be her. Excuse me. I assure you have the wrong person. I'm siren, but I've been making lots of lamps lately. You say a ship was sunk. What happened here? Hey. <laughs> what are you guys doing over there? Huh? What do you mean? We found the siren who sank the ship. The siren? Didn't you hear? We found her already. Uh-oh. Already? Does that mean I'm not getting a reward? It's just your job. Like, I don't think you get a reward for yeah. just doing your job. We only need to punish one of them, so let her go. <laughs> what a rat. Oh, that sure ruined my day. <laughs> yep. So, you don't want to investigate why they have another siren, though. No. Maybe your friend L might also be a siren? No. <laughs> hmm, I wonder why you can't find her. Now we need to go to the beach. Love this jaunty tune. There's, There's boink a boink over there. over there. There's a boink over there. 
Yeah, the other sirens might be mad if you leave her to shrivel up and die. They're only good for singing songs, singing songs and sinking ships. They can't hurt us if we trap them on dry land. Maybe they'll learn not to go around sinking our ships. Mm. Get lost. No, I'm trying to talk to you. I'm trying to talk to you. Don't bug me. Okay. <laughs> what do you want? Okay. You have to talk to all three of them? Uh, yeah, I think so. Okay. Now we're going to the beach beach for some fun in the sun. Fun in the sun. <laughs> We're so nice, just helping people out of the goodness of our hearts. Yeah, just kind of getting up to trouble every day for so no reason besides it's just something to do. What else would you be doing in this world, this unstable world? See, you can crush them again, but it doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. No, doesn't matter. It is kind of fun though. Hey, get back here. Ah, oh, okay. It's cool. We're going this way anyway. Good job, Doug. Get back here. Nice. I will continue to hit triangle on these guys. Yep. Thanks. Works every time. <laughs> cool. Oh my god, you got so much EXP. <laughs> uh. Look, you have blue bar now. I do have blue bar now. Yeah. Um, I, I'm curious about something. I'm going to let you pick up 100% of the experience, and I want to see if I get anything. Yeah. Crap. Okay. Yep. Yeah, I do. So I, yeah, I, so get, yeah. I get my cut, and then whatever I pick up. Yeah. It's crazy. Which literally means it's in my best interest to never pick up experience, right? Pretty much, yeah. Like, because I'm, I, doing I'm literally making you get less experience overall every time I pick up experience. That sucks, but... Eh, it's not a big deal, because, I mean, I'm so buff on stats. Like, I'm well, yeah. sharing it now anyway, too. Right, I'm just saying it. It It's like throwing experience in the trash. Kind of, yeah. A little bit. Yeah, especially, like, with bosses, me picking anything up is just, like, detrimental to your yeah. experience, Please the pet's experience. The yeah. No, nope, you're right. But I need the. It's better for me to have the ring overall to raise the pet. So. Can experience despawn? Yes. Okay, so I guess sometimes I. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So if it's if you're far away, I have to pick it up. I mean, yeah. I guess it's not that big of a deal because. No, this is life and death. <laughs> Please stop. <laughs> it's not that serious. That guy has a cool walk animation. I know. You see Didn't that you guy? See him before. I didn't see him walk the before. Highway? Yeah, I was like, look at that guy go. Okay, so this requires a little bit of finagling. Finally, she made it to her friend. <laughs> Aw, poor Elle. I was the one who sank the ship. No, all you did was sing a song. Sailors say our voices bring misfortune, but they're just making excuses. If I don't sing, no ships will sink. They say I can sing here since it's away from the sailing routes. That's enough. You sound like one of the soldiers. Let the ship sink. You've every right to sing, girl. Then I can choose to stay in here if I like, can't I? You're always kept up in that atelier of yours. Cool word for store. Yeah. <laughs> there are soldiers everywhere, but here it's peaceful. I don't know, dude. It's a big cage. I didn't say freedom is out here in the world. Freedom is inside your heart. Right now, you're shutting yourself off from that. All we do is sing, and those stupid ships sink. Well, I don't care. Just doing what we were born to do. No one has the right to stop us. Well, I mean, if your song makes them fall asleep, that kind of sucks. But... Yeah, maybe sing responsibly. Yeah. Soldiers are constantly on our backs. We live in fear. Is, fr is freedom really worth that trouble? Worth our lives? I was born to be myself. That's freedom. Sing it, Lady Gaga. Okay. So... And the mermaid is just hanging out. This is a little tricky. We have to... We have to get Flamiche to, like, move in a way. Um, when she changes into a bubble, we gotta walk through the gate. 
or else she'll just keep blocking the gate. Okay. Um, yeah. So now they're arguing about it. Blah, blah, blah. And um, she's sticking up for us because we're cool. We learned another language and sold her lamps. And Flamiche is kind of soon and she doesn't care. <laughs> so we're going to go over here. Go. Yep. Yeah. Uh -huh. uh. Nope. I will not step away from the door. What? I think you missed it. Ugh. Dang it. I think we don't have to go that far then. You have to come over here, please. <laughs> no, I think it's purely you. I've had no impact on anything that's no, happening. No, I know, but like you were up there. I think you can go. Yeah. Seriously? Okay. I can't tell if you're going too early or too late. I really have no idea. Uh, so there we go. There we go. Oh. Yep. It's so a another spider. Refight. Oh God. <laughs> yep. Watch out for that. Sorry. Right. Sorry, Doug. I might not. Oh, oh I'm I dead. did hit him. I'm dead. So you're dead. Yeah, that killed me. That sucks. Okay, I'll be all right. Yeah, you'll be fine. Didn't realize that would hit me. That was really rude. Uh, that guy just casted on you. Yeah, that wasn't too bad. I'm okay. No, uh, he's gonna pass. Yeah. Get out of there. <laughs> I think I'm okay. You should have pretty high magic defense on. I think I do. So yeah. like, I, I think I'm just okay. And then oh, try one of these. Not again. Ah! It somehow didn't get us. Well, I ulted there, so. Okay. That's crazy. Oh, turn around. Oh, dude. <laughs> oh, mm. God. Oh, God. Get out of there. Okay. Bud down. Ow. <laughs> Yeah, these guys. This Bud has sucks fallen. Time. Um, you should Ow. be able to ult. Yeah. Just to buy some time. Shut him down. Oops. Is this the last one? No, they just no. keep appearing until okay. you get at him. Uh. Oh, I'm behind. Oh. Nope. Yep, you're good. There we go. Please stop doing that. I'm almost there. Please stop doing that. <laughs> yeah. Bud lives. Oh, this guy's so annoying. <laughs> yeah, this guy's like, uh, he was hard last time too. Like, a it's just bit, because yeah. he has a lot of like one shot attacks that just happen completely yeah. randomly. Watch like, out, I think he's out. using it right now. Yeah. Bud lives. Wow. That pushed me. Hata! Oh, okay. Yeah, I don't know don't, if I got him. It's not worth really attacking that guy because he'll just die after he does his ult. Ah. Yeah, it's pretty much. He's on a timer. This one won't, though. Yeah, I don't think I realized it was a difference, but okay. Yeah. Get that. Oh, yeah, let's not wait it out here. Ow. Okay. Doug's dead again. It's alright. Yeah, just let him die. I think it's this one that, yeah, once we kill him. Do we win or did we no. soft lock? No. Okay. I'm just waiting. I don't think I've ever soft locked this game, truthfully. <laughs> I don't know how. I'm sure you can. There you go. We're fine. That was close. Um, okay. No, we're good. We're good. Why? Oh. It doesn't matter. Know, like, he was dead in it. <laughs> Just wasted my ult. This boss sucks. I'm glad we had to fight him twice. He's, like, really unfun to fight. Yeah, it's solo. This boss is tough. He's just not fun. Like, he's just not. Like, we get exactly what to do. Yep. Also, being in a small arena. But down. Yeah, with that attack really sucks. It's, it's tough. No. Nope, nope, nope. Oh, good thing I picked up a new, uh, okay, a new spear. <laughs> yeah, that helped. Okay. 
Sire Tropicala, you are dead. There we go. And you got all the experience. Great. Cool. Nice. Not bad. We all got some experience. No, we cannot get that chest. We have to come back up, up here and get it later. A reward for a quest in Legend of Mana? No. No. We got some experience. <laughs> All right, so we killed the monster. She's free to go. And she doesn't want to, predictably. <laughs> you can be a coward if you want. Okay, cool. Yep. I don't know. It seems kind of nice in here. Yeah, we basically just got you a studio apartment. Yeah. We turned a jail cell into a studio apartment. Uh-huh. From the outside, it kind of looks like a cage, but from the inside, it looks pretty nice. <laughs> blah, blah, blah. Girlfriends are going to talk, and we're done. And we can't, we really can't loot that chest. No, that's. You have to go back up there. That's awesome. <laughs> Her art is really cool. That's though. awesome. It's not that big of a deal. <laughs> and you know, when you open it, it'll just be like it's nothing. It's like a material or something. Here's five bucks. Right. Nice. Cool. Um, cool. All right. So, I'm not sure if that's the last quest in like the mermaid arc or whatever. It might be. I don't know if we see them again. Okay. I'm gonna go do some chores. Oh, I trust I'm still in. I put my controller down. You are I put still it down in. too early. Sorry. We have two orchards to go harvest now. Ugh. Okay. <laughs> I wish I could literally help you in any way. I know. Me too. We say this every single time, too. I think I'm getting faster at it, though. So. <laughs> You're just finding out where the magic pixels are to, like, pick up each fruit. Yeah. Just spamming X. <laughs> Do -do -do. Do -do. There we go. <laughs> Yummy, spiny carrot. But we'll watch you. Because mm -hmm. I can't do anything. <laughs> Teaching him how to garden from back there. Even though I may or may not be like older than you. I, I don't know. It's I unclear. Think... Maybe maybe you are. Who knows? Yeah. It's impossible to know if Bud is a child or a middle-aged gnome yeah, or... Yeah, I think they're kids, though. Like, kids relatively being, like... Right, but then the punchline is always, like, he's a 36-year-old child. Well, they did say humans live 500 years. That's also true. Yeah, so... In this world. Ugh, that's all you gave me, dude? Ugh. It's never gonna give me anything good. There, do you... Like this. Like this. Oh no, did we did we do the cactus for the last one? What? Did we miss a cactus? This isn't home. No, I know. I'm just saying did we miss a cactus for the last one? What? I don't know. Uh, did we? I don't know. I don't think so. I think I did it while we were talking about something. Great. Now you're scaring me. Well, we can take a look in the... Also, you went to Domino, not home. Yeah, I just realized that. We may have missed a cactus for that one. Oops. I feel like we definitely didn't talk to him for one, but... Unless I just did it super quick. <laughs> well, if we picked up Bud, that means we were definitely in the house. Mm -hmm. I think I went upstairs. Well, we'll find out. We will find out after these messages from our farm sponsors. So again, to reiterate, we're doing this because there's a chance that you will get a fruit that is way better. Yes, but mostly I just want the seeds, man. Like, I don't care that much about growing the rare fruit. I'm not that invested in that. I want the better seeds that you can get from him because and they're... You can't really get them from the world, and nobody sells nobody and, sells spiny seeds. And they are critical for certain item recipes. Yes. So that's why we have to do... I just feel the need to reiterate that, because you've now seen us pick about 
200 fruits. A billion fruits and vegetables. And you're like, yeah. why? It's like, okay, well, we are looking for a specific type of seed. Yes. The specific type of fruit is cool, yeah. but the seed is the key. And that guy who sold me those other seeds was selling some of the rarer fruits that you can grow. So now that I know that, if I really needed one for a recipe, I can just go buy it from him. Gotcha. Yeah. Um. Because there are there are some recipes that call for like some of the rarer ones, like the gold dia laurels or whatever. Yeah. But I really just want the seeds from him. Okay. And of course, he gave us nothing. Yeah. Getting spiny seeds from this guy is tough. Like, feels impossible, honestly. More. It is also just awesome that you can't just fill them up in one dialogue. You have to do I know, it I know. again. Very Animal Crossing of this. <laughs> Take your time, all that. Okay. Come okay, back good. again. Gosh, now I'm. So I feel better afraid. about again the part where we have Bud makes me think that yeah, I went upstairs and then I came. Back I think downstairs. so. I think so because I think I remember coming downstairs and saying we're gonna grab Bud for this one, but. Maybe not. I might have just walked right out of the house. Da, da, da. Well, we did. We did the crab snappy one. Yeah. Right, he has to put this one in. If not, oh well. What was after the crab snappy one? There was like another one. The, the, well, the hotel one. The, the hotel one. Yeah. I was not with you for that. Nope. So. Just walking back and forth and talking. Mmm. Mind your own business, broom, diddles, had it, none of these. Siren song, candle, you summer, summer one. loving was the crab one. Yeah. Uh, I don't remember. It's drowned dreams. I don't think we did it. Nope. Oop. Yeah, I did miss it. Drowned dreams. Do you remember what the quest number was? There's a number on these. Only the game is, is numbered because you're not going in order. Cage of Dreams? No. Nah, I missed it. GG's. It's ruined. I'm shutting everything off. <laughs> I'm not going to get the achievement. If there well, even is one. There probably is one. Like, I would not... I don't know why there wouldn't be one. Mm -hmm. But, yeah. Um, I think that's actually on that disappointing and note. And you can't... You can't, stop. you can't double talk to him? No. No. Because we basically overrode the chance to talk to him. Um, Can you humor me and try it real quick? I believe you. I I've just... done it already, but yeah, I will. Dot, 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 talk to him, dot, dot, dot. Because you already <sighs> overrode the chance to talk to him when the next event started. So the game's also, like, GG's. We're, if we stop now, it is a bit of a shorty. Is that okay with you? Shorty, <laughs> relatively speaking. Is it? Yeah, we're still, you know, I get the two and a half hours is a long time by any other metric, <laughs> but we are still in major shorty territory. Okay. Um, I, it just feels like this one was really long, maybe because there's so much talking going on. Yeah. Um, my throat is hurting a little bit, but we can do this next part of the dragon arc. It's sure. Because kind of, we kind of haven't, and I think this almost completes it. This is like the second to last part <laughs> for it. So it's a little bit of a long one. Um. So we're gonna pick up Lark for this one. So yay! To play our fun dragoon friend again. I'm bummed we missed our quest. Yeah. Uh, I, mean, I feel responsible. I'm the second set of eyes. I was just gonna say I have two set, two more sets of eyes here, and you just let me walk on by. I don't know how we managed to pick up, but it's it literally. I'm gonna tell you because what it was. I might have just walked inside and. Just it's picked it's. Him up. Literally as simple as like you it was the first time you went to the different garden and because the, yeah. the second garden is so Just the original garden again like your brain was like I already did everything right. like I'm My good brain broke on the routine. Yep. So it's yep. fine. Yep. It's yep. Not yep. A big deal. yep. 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 I can grab it on the next playthrough Major bummer. Yeah, it looks like an egg. Oh now it does not at all <laughs> So we're not going to geo yet we just needed to place Geo. Okay. Is the hook the last world, or we still have another one? We still have one or two after that. Gotcha. Yeah, if I recall correctly. It could be three, but I think it's two. After that. 
Wow. Okay. Let's go to hell. But not really. We're not going to hell. Long walk. <sighs> that was a long walk. Now that we have like 30 worlds placed. <laughs> Good, that means more days are passing and we're growing fruit all the time. Mm -hmm. All right, Lark. Sure, yep. I'm ready, let's do it. Let's go to the forest, which we just placed. And we sit in silence as we do that. Good. Mm -hmm. It's kind of cool that eventually all the dragon places get to be next to each other. I like this forest a lot. It's really cool. Mm -hmm. Is it going to be a new um, you've background? You've kind of seen it already. Okay. But you get to see more of this. So. Vadas. Vadis. Okay. <laughs> something in this forest that throws off my senses. What do you mean? Vadis does not want to be found, but find her we will. I definitely will take the lead. Thanks. We both focus, we can track her down. This is the dragon princess. Onward! Uh, mm -hmm. uh, yeah, he'll turn around in this one and just tell you if you're on the right path. Gotcha. Yeah, if you're not following something. Do I- I wonder if I share, like, your companion shares the same level. Because, like, Obviously, sure. he did not have blue health last time we played as him, uh -huh. but he does now. It's possible that, yeah, he does scale. What are we missing? Oh, sorry, I also, picked up. Also, please, so. yeah, don't do that. <laughs> That's okay. Um, yeah, let's check that out. So I'm level 30? Yep. So I Am guess... I your level, or am I... What do you mean? Like, am I always your level, or is the NPC a unique level? I like, have... do I share experience? Hold on, wait. Is my experience number exactly the same as yours? No. No. Okay. Interesting. Yeah, because remember they're slightly more buff than you are, like just beginning with them. So I mm -hmm. think that yes, it scales to your level, <clears throat> but yeah, they they're always just going to be stronger no matter what. Like their stats are going to be much higher than yours. Right. Anyway. Right. Right. I got you. Yeah. How, dude? Okay. Let's grab all that. Yeah. Get out of the way. I mean, I'm gonna share it with you anyway. So. Right, right. That's what I'm saying. I just gotta like backdash or something. It's. I mean, it's really not that big of a deal. Like, we're good. <laughs> I would say the boss crystals. Don't pick those up if mm -hmm. you can help it, because those are where you get. Right, I got you. Experience. I got you. Yeah, because they're big fat crystals. Uh, thanks for confirming, Lark. Every single time. Oh, that is a monster. Okay. I know. I always forget that he's a tree man right here because he kind of blends pretty well. You can get one of those guys too. Really? Mm -hmm. It's a hatch. You can get a garbage like monster too. Nice. Doug, welcome to the crew. Oh, I like that little, this little Caterpie guy right here. He he's really cute. looks like a Caterpie. Yeah, he's super cute. Oh, okay. All you. Candy! What does the candy do again? I don't know, it just restores your health, or they might restore status effects, but I think, I think they just restore health. Okay. There's like a chocolate bar and, um, and the bubble gum, mm -hmm. so. But again, because it drops at the end, like, it's like, who cares? It doesn't really matter. It's just fun to pick it up. Uh, this way? This way. Yes. I, I concur. This way. <laughs> Absolutely this way. God, it's so hard to see here, though. There's literally nothing worse in, like, side-scrollers when there's, like, environmental stuff, stuff that's in the, in, the, in the foreground. Yeah. It's so bad. It's bad design 100% of the time, and I don't care who disagrees. Like, it's so bad. Yeah. Because there's no conceivable reason why your character would have trouble seeing. It's literally you... The player. Like you, the player. It's dumb. It doesn't make any sense. Mm, I agree. 
Alright, we are confronting Sierra, or rather she is confronting us. You're blind to the truth, Lark. Do you not see what Dracus is trying to do? I don't think he really cares. <laughs> He did not order you to slay dragons for the sake of petty revenge. He's trying to take the mana energy, source of the world's power, for himself. That much I know. Yeah, so? Yeah, duh. Whatever. Like, <laughs> you're a fool. Do you not see what would happen if Draconis returned to the surface? I, I mean, he would destroy the world. <laughs> Draconis returns to the surface, and as his knight, I shall return with him. Yes. Sis, please do the math. Like, yeah, look, we're on his his team. Because we have to be. Like, mm -hmm. I would like my soul back. Sierra, do not interfere. I'm a dragoon too, but my duty is to maintain order in the world as my dragon master wishes. <sighs> okay. I don't think I'm trying to protect, or I don't think I'm trying to disrupt peace. I just bought my soul back. She's so Whoa. cool. Okay. She's the coolest freaking dragon. That's on the a legendary Pokemon if I've ever seen one. She's so cool. Like I love her design. I think she's the most classical dragon that you can get. Uh huh. <laughs> Brother and sister must not shed the blood they share. Tell me where the monostone is kept. Obey me, and I shall. I will spare you the same fate as the other two. I don't think she cares. She's willing to die for. Yeah, I mean, we're here duty. to kill you. I, whatever. Yep. I see. The monosote is straight down that path. Good dragon. Tss, sir? Lark, you will see the error of your ways. Nah, probably not. Probably not. She'll soon be free, of course, so will Draconis. Like, you guys, like, yeah, exactly. You guys think that he doesn't have a plan? Like, he's not gonna turn on that guy? Filled your duty, you need not stay with me any longer. He's just gonna peace out on us now. That's all I can offer you by way of payment. I don't know if that's good or not. No. Okay. Give us a flimsy material. Cool. Thanks. I sure have been dragged into this. You're now as much a part of it as we are. Great. Dragonus is not soft, the entire world will suffer. I know there's a lot to ask, but you must not turn your back on this. I'm really trying not to. I don't know what happens there if you say it's none of your business. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure it just ends the quest and you fail it. Maybe. Of course. Show me your strength. Oh, do we fight her anyway? Yeah. Oh, okay, but I don't. Good luck. Yep. You fight them all? Yep. Actually, I think I fight Seer. Oh, no, I fight both of them. Yeah, she has a separate health bar, although she's not. Shit. Mm, I might ult just for safety. I... No, we're good. Oh, Doug's not, though. Puts you to sleep. Oh. Yes. Yeah, that it hit her I at least. Sierra. Ow. Yes. Spear. Go mm, good. Here comes again. I don't know. Oh. Uh, get out of there. Oh. oh. You're fine. I tried to jump and I pressed the button. Oh, and you're button. asleep on no, top I'm of asleep. that. I might die. No, okay. I believe in you. Clutch it out. Please. <laughs> um, Are you able to pause here? Why? Uh, like you're not able to pull up your menu. I was gonna say you oh, should. Oh no! You Why would you be able to pull up your menu? I was gonna. I was gonna say a quick crouch and then just stand in the corner no. and heal. This is not how that game works. <laughs> if you're not ready, uh, get out of. The okay, you're fine. You're fine. I think Sierra, Sierra has to go, I and know. then yeah. Doug, please wake up. <sighs> I'm dead. I'm dead. Hide, hide. Okay. I, I can't. Also, she is fast. <laughs> wow, you're right back in there, okay. Yeah, I mean... Here we go. If you just kill the dragon, does it end? I don't think so. I think you have to kill both of them. I feel like she would yield if you just killed the no. dragon. I'd rather just get her out of the way first, because she's so fast. Well, she has a ton of health, that's my point. I know, but she's supposed to. She is a dragon. But the dragon doesn't, though. No, the dragon doesn't. God, Sierra, stop. Hmm, interesting. Good impact. Yeah, um, she is just getting her health back. Just FYI. Oh, is she? Yeah, the dragon has to die. She literally is healing every time you damage her. 
Oh, See, really? it, it literally is just resetting her health. Yep. Hey, 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 go, take care of her, huh? Okay, I might have to die again, so... Yeah, she's just... she's hammering That's me. a little lame, but, like, that's... That's life, dude. The like, game literally... It, like, it's... It's actually insanely whack game design in that, like, it gives you no indication the dragon is healing Sierra, but you just have to watch her health bar oh, refill. No, she's not. Yeah. She definitely is healing. Okay, you made me second guess that, and I don't think she is because I've killed her before. I don't think she is. She literally wasn't. Okay. You're she the just boss. has a lot of health. You're player one. Get him. Yeah, I'm trying. <laughs> But Vidis is weak, so. <sighs> Shit. That's okay. It's fine. Yeah, it keeps her off you anyway. Oh no, not Doug! <laughs> oh, you bounced yeah. her back. Yeah. Crap. Please go away. Oh yeah, being able to uppercut like that and delaying her like boss attacks, yeah. that's the move. I know. Wow. Wow. She kind of just lands in the same place though. But that's a good thing, because she's not attacking you. I know. She hates it. Ah. Okay, I can jump too. Uh... Okay, let's hope this doesn't whiff, because it takes a long time to get an ult up. You're good, you got them both. She's gonna die. Weird. She like has like she multiple has layers health. of the blue bar. Yeah, That's... no, that means her health is super it's just, strong. It's just weird that I don't, I don't know why that weirds you out. It's just how this game works. Right, but like the blue bar like resets. It doesn't though. Mm. I don't know what you're looking at. It's just multiple layers of health because that's how they decided to fit health bars. But like it didn't change color though. Like, that's what I'm saying. Like, it no, would go... I think I was just depleting it fast enough on each bar that okay. it went from blue okay. to green to blue to green. Okay. Or blue, 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 blue. All right, you got him. Yeah. It's fine. No experience for you, though. I know. You are technically, like, killing them. <laughs> well, not killing them. I think you're just battling them at this point. My liege. <laughs> so proper. Close her eyes. Harnesses her quan for a second. I think she dies at some point. I don't know. Uh, she seems like a character who's gonna die, yes. I didn't do it, dude. Like, it wasn't me. <laughs> Alright, do you want to play the end of the dragon arc? Sure. But we should... Do we want to go back to the cactus? Or... Yeah, of course. I wasn't sure if we were just forsaking the whole thing no, now that no, we've whiffed it. No, no. <laughs> I'm gonna get what I can get. Like, I don't care. But it's going to make it so much worse when you see the one... Oh. Did you mean... Oh, okay. Yeah. It's going to make it so much worse when you see one missing page. So I think what happens in New Game Plus 2 is it doesn't reset. Oh, I'm sure it doesn't. Yeah. But. So it'll just be the one, and then eventually I'll fill in the one. At least that's an easy one. It's literally just talking. Right. Like, you don't get to it, obviously, until the latter half of the game, but... Yeah, it's fine. Mm -hmm. Come on, come on. I need those shoes. It's lame that you couldn't use your co-op par partner for that last fight, because I feel like you would have definitely wouldn't have died. I mean, it's fine. Sometimes you gotta die to learn how to do. We the were game deathless, better. though. We were doing the run. The game doesn't punish you for death, honestly, which I oh, think is... Oh, it, it literally just started the fight over. There was not even a load. It was like, okay. Which I think is fine. A because... very small part of me expected you to just get up again, like, without the boss even resetting, but I was happy <laughs> no. to see that you don't. Games that do that, like, the, like continuing, and then your character just gets up with no consequence, I'm always like, okay. Yeah, they just want you to learn the fight and... I think you can just reload a save if you are somehow underleveled for mm -hmm. that part, but there's really no reason you should be underleveled by then, because mm -hmm. they give you plenty of opportunities to, like, buy better weapons and shit. I mean, I, I'm glad that we did, because I think my weapon itself wouldn't have been very good there. 
it would have taken longer for sure. Yeah. Can I give him one flat seed? Because we have enough. He keeps giving me flat seeds. <laughs> okay, bye. Bye, Trent, too. Did he have a name? No. No. No, he was just like something na 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 about Trent. And I was like, okay. okay. Cool. I guess you could say he's just like a clone of Trent. I don't know. Son of Trent. Son of Trent. <laughs> <laughs> Ent, son of Trent. Yes. And I don't think Trent ever mentions like you going over there he just gives you the seed and it's like be on your way <laughs> go make another one of me doing our our doing our dailies doing our dailies <laughs> In my head, I'm working on a pun, and it like I, I lost brain power trying to <laughs> conjure it. I was like, Trent Trenier, and then Trent Trunier, and see, it didn't work. But it caused my brain to just short circuit <laughs> while I was thinking about how to make it work. Come on, give me the mush in a box. Not really in a box, though. He looks like he's in a pot. <laughs> give me. Okay. Let's get our seeds. Let us get our seeds. There are some seeds. The all there. important seeds. Yes. Give me a spiny seed. Nothing. Spiny seed? Just worthless. Spiny seed? Nothing. No. A complete waste of time. The fat. Give me two of these. Give me one more. Give me one more. Small seed. Well, at least I don't have to run or hold square to run. Correct. Yep. It's definitely a source of like controller hand pain back in the day. Ugh. Okay. Little cactus. I think that is what happened. I think I just walked back in, and like. You figured you did this like, already, oh. yeah. Yeah. I said, Bud, come with me. Had to be a dog. Had to be dog. Had to be dog. What does that mean? I don't. It's cactus code. Had to be dog. Scribble, scribble. Okay. Now. Lark again. Oh, it's a really long one. That's fine. Okay. Really long in this game is usually like 15 minutes. <laughs> I know. But if you don't have a map or directions, oh, it can turn into like a half an hour of wandering around. Um. Hello. Gotta walk back to the place where the party member is. You can't just call them on your cell phone or something. Cosmic cell phone. Cell phone? What is that? <sighs> and instead of having them just stand outside your house, you have to walk past a bunch of sproutlings. It's fun. Yeah, those guys are a nuisance, man. Wait, is he just inside now? Sierra. <gasps> yeah, I, we know, dude. We know that dude. you're Sierra, my dude. Like... <laughs> okay. I'm gonna hunt down your own brother. Nope. All right, I'll be your guide to help. I Do guess. I play as her, or does yes. she just run? Okay. She's gonna. Yep. Okay. I've been here before. I know the way. <sighs> Wait. What? Can we just go? <laughs> Sense evil. You're in hell. Right. Like, what an astute observation. Yeah, Drachmas is here too. Duh. Yeah. <laughs> How endearing. It's a little token of my appreciation. Enjoy. How about the... I think she can handle them. The Crimson Dragon. Cool. Huh? <laughs> I love my bewildered stance. It's great. 
cheap tricks. That was an expensive trick, dude. Like. <sighs> Run past these two again. Yeah, I don't know. They're the. I would love to be like the second floor guy. Honestly, just hanging out up there. You don't have to do anything. Nobody ever gets that yeah, far. You don't have to worry about it. It's true. All they have to do is say, hello, welcome to Walmart. <laughs> Hell greeters. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I feel like there's just no enemies here. Like, for There's no enemies in like these weirdo hallways, but we, this one, we pass. No, not this one. I think it's the next door. We passed, like, through the first door, we passed oh, some. Now you've done it. Sorry. This one. This doorway. Yep, we're just going this way. <laughs> There's some. Here we go. Some Let's lags. see how her triangle is. It's probably decent. Ooh, okay. It's one of those triangles that I hate in this game where like it, it does a lot of damage, don't get me wrong. But, it's like but like delayed. you're you're mad vulnerable after you uh, hit it, even if you even if they don't like dodge it in any way, you're just standing there. Right. It takes you way too long to reset. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Don't enjoy that move list. Yeah, it's rough. And it's why in this game I prefer a faster like weapon, like a spear. Sorry, sorry. That's fine. That's fine. It's really not that big of a deal. It Ow. is to me. Okay. We must maximize our experience. Oh my god, I hate these little guys. I mean, you have... You, the player, have, like, so much of a chance to get much more experience. Okay. Yep, just open up for me. Thank you. Um, you have a chance to get so much more experience in the next playthrough. Like, hey, this music doesn't fit this zone at all. I don't think it does either. Um, first door. Oh, no. But let's grab this. Take the box. Mm -hmm. Free box. Free box. Grave dirt. Grave mm -hmm. dirt. Yummy. Thank God. I don't think the music fits either. It really sounds like... It's just... It's our generic adventuring music. Yeah. I feel like you could do a little bit more for this for zone. Hell? Yeah. I agree. Something to fit the tone a little bit. Okay, again, I'm overly harsh on stuff like that with this game, but like, it's kind of all the game has is the music because there's just no sound. Yeah. Like, and it has fun noises. I like the noises a lot. I mean, yeah, game. it has JRPG noises. Wait, how did we do this? Did we go on this? How do? We go? Wait, what? Huh? Just. We are in hell. Yeah, we're in a different uh, zone, though. It is hell, remember? Okay. I think we have to go up through that again. Let us through. Okay. Oh. Uh-oh. It's the bottom of the other world. We want that. Yep. Wait. Sounds evil. You don't say. Yeah, dog, let's do it. Yeah, I think we're ready to bang. Let's go. Onward. Serious? Very serious, if you can't tell. Oh no, do we have to fight him now? Um, maybe. He seems kind of dead on the floor. Oh, sorry, I had to sit up a bit. You gotta assume your fight evil stance? Yes. Okay. Served me well, Locke. Uh, did we know this guy was evil before? Yeah, heck yeah, we okay, did. Okay, all right. He literally was like, yo, you're strong. I want to use you to kill them dragons and get all the monastones. And you're like, that sounds awful. And he's like, you know what? You got to do it because I have your soul. It's pretty evil, honestly. Yep. There's a, I mean, there's a reason that he's down here like this. Uh -huh. Anyway. Not so fast. Everybody gotta wait for Doug. Doug's coming. <laughs> Doug is here now. Doug is here. I can't tell if that's a gag or like just a dumb thing. No, I think it's just a dumb thing. Like with... he has to walk up because he doesn't yeah. have like a run. Right. Draconis is using you. Yeah. No, no shit. 
I think he can. Mm -hmm. Let me put a stop to him. He can hear you guys, you know. <sighs> Did you hear me? I'm gonna beat your ass. <laughs> I'm gonna fight you. <laughs> When the time of return is at hand, you and I will fight. We're gonna throw fisticuffs. <laughs> Only the victors shall win back their life. That was our agreement. Was? Mm, I don't think he's going to hold to that. Mm. Served me well, so I should make good on my word. First, you must accept your reward. Oh god, what are you doing to him? <laughs> I guess his reward is to, um, yeah, become a big bad warrior. I really granted him his wish. <laughs> get it, get it, get it. Oh, oh, oh. Like, no! Ah! Ow, oh, this hurts. I like that they faded to white, but didn't have him transform during that. That was just weird. That was a weird fade to white. It's fine. Now he's transforming. Into some random other sprite. Nice. It's a big centaur boy. That we fought pretty much exactly already. Okay. Yeah. Cool. Good job. Got him. I think he has kind of the same moves slightly too. Nope, nope. See, there he goes. Nope. Not blinking that again. That kind of cool. Yeah, he was blinking. But again, he stops blinking, so but I like don't know what. You should know because he's in the middle of his animation. Mm -hmm. Like I don't. I disagree. I, I disagree with you. I disagree with the disagreement. I went up and I tried to poke the D's too when she stopped blinking in the middle of her animation, but it didn't work. So I'm just gonna I flip. At that point, you just have to assume that they're in the middle of their animation, they're completely vulner invulnerable. Which is annoying, but... I wonder if the blinking just doesn't work with their animation. That's why they don't do it. I have no idea. <laughs> Alright, so he's kind of dead. Yeah. Goodbye. He has turned Yay. his head to the side, that's how you know he's truly dead. <laughs> he's faded away. Like a Jedi. Uh oh. Ah, we're all gonna blast off. <laughs> that was funny. Blast it off into the map. Something's happening. Oh, is this zone gonna change like the other one? That's cool. Yeah. I think it's a temporary area though. I'm not mistaken. I'm sure it's like we're pretty much done with this area and it's going to be like we run through it and then yeah. it's done. Yeah. It is a cool area though. Do we roll right into this? I believe so. Yes. Hmm. Ooh. It's kind of Castlevania E. It is kind of Castlevania E. <laughs> Pant, pant. So this is the flames. It's his fortress that he's apparently just been building under there this whole time and nobody's really, you know, told him to knock it off. Oh, goodies. It's my spirit form. My soul is there with you, but my body is not. We'll stop him. There's a powerful barrier in place here. Once you pass beyond it, you may be unable to return. I like how she her animation points, is yeah, to point. It's to point. <laughs> okay. Okay. So I think it's fine. We're standing right here. Let's mm -hmm. do it. Mark was consumed. Yikes. His darkness's weakness is his solitude. He trusts no one. He prevents no one. What should I do? All life is connected by ties that bind us to the world itself. That is your answer. Bonds of life bring love and support. They will help you greatly. Okay. Puma, do you remember my warning about darkness? No. Yep, apparently yep. we do. You just get to choose that. That's like the most text that you have, and you're quoting somebody else. 
Okay. Yep, 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 yep. The world thrives on such bonds, their existence is the law of nature. Okay. So she's giving us her life force, and we're gonna go fight together. And Doug, too. And Doug, too. Did you see that? He stepped up. Okay. Uh, I do not have control right now. Okay. Please do not run from this great undertaking. Choco, you wanna come fight, too? <laughs> <laughs> Let us fight together. Of course. You never return. I'm sure you're ready. Sure. Absolutely. Is this a whole dungeon or do we just go yep. in and fight? Okay. Yep. There's like a whole thing. Okay. Which is kind of nice. It's like a two-parter. Mm -hmm. It's the end. Okay. Shh. Hush now, darling. Uh, do we have to go up first? Yes. Hey, hey. You have to come with me. <laughs> Sorry, I'm also oh. trying to entertain the cat. Fair. There we go. Uh... Oh, hi. <laughs> we went the wrong way, I apologize. We will find our way through this place. Ah. Hello. I'm getting the stare from the child. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Choco, you gotta cool it for like a ten minutes. Bit, yeah, that's not quite his time yet. Actually. No, I don't know why. A little bit of meta here. I don't know why <laughs> the cat keeps doing this because it's like well before the time he's normally fed. Right. I don't know what, like, why he thinks like again. Well, he's like two hours early almost. Like, but he's been doing it consistently. Mm -hmm. I don't know if someone is sneaking in here and feeding him right now, right. but. There's one of those goblin guys. I know, yeah, we fought him a couple times, and I'm trying to connect with him. There oh, we go. You are dying. What level is Sierra? That's what I'm curious about. Can you check after this? Yeah. Wow, I'm curious if she's like. A of health. Because she does not have that much health. Mm -hmm. oh, oh, there he goodness. goes. Hello. Let's check. Oh. Wrong, Wrong button. Menu. Triangle, and then. See, so, well, she's behind, but okay. not by much. But still, that's weird. She might just have bum health. I yeah, she kind of does have bum health, and she doesn't do, like, an amount of damage that makes up for no. that. Okay, I have no idea if we're in the right place, to be honest. It with feels you. like we are. Fourth floor? Um, there's a lot more to go, though. This place is a little confusing. On purpose? I love these guys. They have good hit animations. Yeah. I'm sorry. Yeah. There I go, picking them up That's again. It's fine. Look, Doug's getting stronger. Go, Doug, go. I think you might have about Sierra there. Uh, this looks like a puzzle? Is it a puzzle? So I think we have to fall through the floor. Well, we went ahead and did that. Right. Um... Oh, God. Well, we're um, on the other side of the... Yeah. yeah. No, we weren't, because that was a different one. That would drop us even lower, which we don't want. Probably. Oh my god, this one is so long. We might have already messed it up. Let's see. Okay. <clears throat> Ooh, excuse me. My stomach caught on there. <laughs> Fighting makes me hungry. Oh god, I hate her moveless so much. Cause like if you press circle like twice, she just goes into this long like mm. blade barrage, yeah. and if you're missing, you're just and missing you're just for stuck. a while. Yeah. <clears throat> you can only hope with me. <laughs> you can like only hope that they step into your Yeah. Your slash. Yeah. It's very annoying. I have to restart this, like just No, it seems good. Oh. Boss. Weird. Okay, okay, we're supposed to be here. We gotta fight this guy. He's Good. Mini boss. Great. <clears throat> you can also hatch one of these. They're cool. They have a lot of health though. Oh, and we've stunned him. Sorry, dude. See, like, I don't like this when they have a ton of health, like they loop the green and blue bars. Right. That's what I was talking I'm, about with Sierra. Yeah, so I know it's confusing. I'm just used to it. And it's like, well, eventually I will 
get down to yellow and red. But then yellow and red is really one yellow and one red. Mm -hmm. It's it's a little weird. It is weird it, because, like, again, I know I keep bringing it up. I can't stop. Kingdom Hearts when bosses have a ton of colored health bars. They have, like, a whole rainbow to go through. Interesting. The only there are only a couple characters that do that. Like it feels like you're not doing damage. Like Sephiroth's health bar is like this platinum color for a long time in Kingdom Hearts, mm -hmm. before he like even takes real damage. Mm -hmm. These directions are all messed up. I think honestly. Well, that was the boss. So that was a mini boss. Right. So he we killed that thing. Uh huh. Um, Does that mean we are supposed to go back now? So what we're doing is we're trying to kill these so we don't fall through the floor. Well, so we shouldn't fall through the floor now. But sometimes you have to fall through the floor, but like the way that these directions are is <sighs> sometimes people write directions that's just like, like go left, go right when you are already, does that make sense? Like you, like when you're entering the building for the first time, you don't need to tell me to go up. But sometimes directions are written like that, and so you end up getting ahead by like one. So what you're saying is you just use a map, like just show me the map. But the, it's yes, but there's no. You have to go in a specific order here to get to the things that you need to kill. Okay, well we don't fall now, so that's good. Right. Oops. Hmm? So like it's telling me to go to the lower left. What does that mean? Lower <laughs> left, what? Right the here. Come this way, come this way, please. This, I guess? This. Yeah. I mean, I, I would say that's lower left. Yeah. So okay, we don't good. fall. We didn't fall. So... Seems good. Fight some Dargons. More Dargons. You can also hatch these guys. I love the little kid dragon. He's so cute. I've always wanted one. And we got to talk about how much Doug sucks. Kinda sucks. He's like our mascot, but he does suck. Yeah. Okay, so down. It's a really long list of. Let's see if we fall. Nope. Oh yeah. Yes. We're gonna fall. Let me get on we there to fall. To do that. Okay. That sucks. I don't think we can go up through there. No, that seems good. Blue. Right. Yeah. What about this door? Okay. Here, Here he comes. comes. Great. Okay, I guess we just found our way here. We're doing great. This is just natural gaming sense. And last centaur. Woo! Like Another that. centaur refight. Love yeah. it. It's a little bit stronger. It's gonna punch. It's gonna punch. No, oh not. my god, please. Sorry. No, no, I just, like, I did one attack and then I just couldn't do my ult. Oh. Okay. Oh, sorry, I'm stuck. Just swinging. <laughs> jump with her, can't you? I can oh, backflip. Back. Wow, he uh, completely whiffed. Yeah, he whiffed. <laughs> Sucks to be hit. My son, please. Choco. <laughs> he's giving me this deathly glare. Like He's like, you are not feeding. It's like, dude, you are so early, sir. Pretty early. He's got about an hour. I, yeah, I don't know. That's okay. Okay. Blue Orb boss, we we did it. We did it. Okay. Let me follow it from there. Upper right. Up, 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 up. Yep, we're just gonna go up now. And he doesn't, he cannot be appeased, by the way. I'm like trying to pet him and he's like, dude, no. No, <laughs> absolutely not. That is cats for ya. <laughs> Shh, please. Okay, up, 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 oh. I mean, we have to, right? I don't think so. Well, this is completely new, so. All right. Oh, so that's a barrier right there. So we want, don't we want to go Oops. up? Yeah, let's go up that way. We're close, we're getting close. Yeah. We need to defeat those guys. There, we need to defeat something to make those barriers go away. I'm just gonna get this guy. You take care Dude, of the Mad Mallard. please. <laughs> I. I hate controlling this character. I she is so not fun. Well, she's holding like knife knives. Oh wow, that guy's killing you. Her defense is bad. Yeah, um, her defense is trash. Her attack is trash. Her move list is trash. Her ults are trash. Oh, like she's cool. She is an F tier character that is unfun to play as. 
Well, you gotta help me out here. Is this the only mission I have to play as her? Yeah. Thank God. Yeah, we're ending this arc. Uh, okay. Well, that's good. That is good. Uh, we have been okay, here, we be here before. Uh, making an executive decision. Well, just for this one area. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm with you. No, go ahead. Choco, please, sir. I think he'll be quiet once we... Well, we've we're gonna never... Fall. No, we're good. And we've never been here before, so... Yeah, I think we did, but then we turned back because I think I knew we were going to fall. So let's go this way. Oh my god, I got interrupted. I'm trying to visor harp you guys. There we go. These guys have oh. so much health, dude. Like, so this much is health. This kind of your test for, like, near the end of the game if you're leveled or not. Are we near the end of the game? A little bit. Like, not too much, but, like, about maybe, like, 15? Maybe maybe a little bit more than that. Like, 20 to go? 20 stages? Maybe. Yeah. I wasn't counting this time. Oh, okay. This place is... Basement? That seems good. We've never no, been in basement. we want to be down here. Are you sure? I think so. We might as well see it. I assume there's got to be a gem down here that we can hit anyway, so... Maybe? I don't think we're supposed to be in the basement. I really can't remember. This place is pretty confusing because of the yeah. puzzle that you have to do. Mm -hmm. Okay, sorry. No, you're fine. <laughs> Please, by all means, kill them. <laughs> like... Yeah, knives? I don't use knives in this game. They are trash! they are really bad. Um, See, boss, this is good. Maybe. This is the red gem. I don't know if this is just a... No, no, it's the red gem room. It might be. I really don't know. The only thing left after this will be pearl, I think. I have no... Pearl? What are you talking There's about? There's like a pearl one that we have to get also, I think. Oh. I think? I don't think so. I think we were supposed to... Well, I think the blue one was supposed to be last, but you can do them in any order. Uh, it's... Okay, it's pulling me. The... It's Doug, 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 Doug. Thank you. Okay, yeah, maybe yeah. I guess. Red gem's done. This is nothing about the basement in this guide. I think this guide needs a rework. <laughs> uh, do you want to skip these guys? Yeah. yeah let's do that. Excuse us. Oops, oops. Pardon us. Turn on our game shark code. Mm. 3D, 2D stairs. <laughs> Doug, come on. Oops. Now we just need the, like, pearl-looking, or the, yeah, the pearl, Basement? right, yeah. We just need the pearl. I don't know unless, what that is. unless I'm tripping and the pearl is actually just, it's off. Yeah, I think, let's see if we can find it. The pearl might just literally be the gem is off. Yeah. We just have to yeah. go up, up, up. Yeah, I think, I think we're just off. good now, yeah. yeah. I know we just have to go up to get to Draconis. Uh, this way? No. Okay. Sure. This is down, so. Uh, this way. This way. Oh, that nope. scared me. It Did it take control away from you, too? For a second. For like a split second? Oh, okay. So the barrier's still there. Right, but we can go... The barrier's here. ...down. Oh. And go. Okay. Seems good box okay great well now we have stinky Ooh, breath stinky breath thank god uh, okay okay there's nothing here even though that looks like the pearl looks like it, but, but again i think the pearl just dead. means it's off yeah. yeah like the stone is inert uh we can go, go no direction there. there cool that's cool 
it take yeah it takes control away from you for a split second there it's so I think weird it, like wants to make you fall mm -hmm. okay we have no other choice yeah, yeah. Yay. Can we keep going? I think so. No. No, that's a dead end. All right, we messed up. <laughs> Sweet. Okay. Well, we're getting stuff at least. Okay. No, we just gotta go back this way. Mm -hmm. mm. Down this way. Have we gone this way? I have no idea. I don't... Yeah. It's fine. We might just have to find our way around. There's only so many ways you can go. And maybe we can just go straight up from the bottom now? Yeah. Yeah. This was the way that we went through for the first time when we got knocked down, which won't happen now. Right. Okay, skip them, guys. Yeah, no, skip them. Whatever. Go so, up. Come this way. We don't want to go up that grand staircase. Just come this way. I'm going this way. I have no choice but to. Uh, well, I do. I just... You are dragging me. <laughs> That's down again, so I'm just making sure. Yeah, I think the grand staircase is the move. Sure. <laughs> Definitely one of the more confusing maps that I'm glad they didn't just Towers of Leers it again. Or Tower Man, of Leers. That would be a tedious amount of combat so, back there, I'll say. Yeah. Okay. Uh, no, this was a boss fight. Was it? Yep. Uh, so we want to just keep going up. Oh my god. I'm going to go this way. Mm -hmm. so, oh, okay. Let me turn back on, just because we have really bad here. Turn around. Oops. There you go. Ugh, just mashing the R1 button for my ult to come out. It's so awesome. This character's so sick. You're so mad. She just, it's like, like the combat in this game, no offense to anyone that likes this game. Hey. <laughs> I'm, I'm just saying, right here. it doesn't feel great, but like, you don't know how bad it feels until you're playing as a character like Sierra and you're just like, Oh my god, actual, please like, attack. There's like, some actual really good characters that you can play as like the second player, but then you get to Sierra and you're just like, oh god. Oh, she just sucks. Yeah. Haha, <laughs> I just nulled out his egg. That was awesome. She's definitely like you have to be right up on them, close combat character. Right, it's and like she has none of the she has none of the advantages of playing like a rogue style character. Right, and all of the disadvantages. Like her damage is trash. Yeah. Unless does she have like backstab? No, she has jump and backflip. Okay. I don't know if the backflip and you attack can do something neat. Like if I jump with the spear and then attack, like I can do a attack like that. Let's try that. Let's find... Nope. I can jump and immediately land. How about jump in this? Nope. I'm just gonna do this and get rid of them. Yeah, go ahead. Don't let me slow you down. Oh, really? Give me, give me, give me them tasty crystals. Here, Doug, it's all up to you. <sighs> Sorry, I would have helped, but I was too busy just swinging at nothing like an idiot. <laughs> No idea if we're going the right way or not. Seems good. I, I mean, no. no. Why no? We already went through all of that right there. That's impossible because no, we. No, it's not. That's the way that this this map works. Look, see now we're on the other side of it. Mm, yep, I... that's the way that this map works. And there's something that we there's an area that we're not getting to that we need to get to, but we will. I don't know how we could possibly be going the wrong way when we already went up that staircase, which, like, how could that loop around when we weren't looping around before? Because we approached it from a different side. I'm telling you right now. It's not that... it's not that hard. We'll get to it. Here, I'll do this one. Okay. See, we're just going the back the way we came. Mm -hmm. Let me go this way. Ah, I keep getting... It's because we have the exact same walk cycle. I know. We're basically just trying everything until we can... Please. Oh my god. This is down again. I, 
I see that. This okay. is the basement this is route. The basement. There's something that we're missing because I think we need to get those barriers to come down somehow. I mean, we just need to hit that room from the angle where we come up on the other side of the barrier. That's right. what I'm saying. Right, right, right. Okay, so we already went, but we were already on the other side of the barrier. So but like the good side. This way though? Sure. I think we fought the boss this way though. <laughs> yeah. Well, this is good stairs. Third floor Four. stairs. Yeah. This More is. Stairs. I think this is the this... the spot where we got knocked down the very first time. So yes. if we go through here. Oh my god. Maybe. Yeah, here we, we go. got we got knocked to the ground here. So this is definitely Ooh, it. Dragon breath. We've I done mean, it. Okay, it. It is very confusing, though. Mm -hmm. <sighs> Why did you get to move before me? I couldn't. That was oh, okay. scripted. It's just all of us. That was so weird. Now we get to fight him. We're going to stop you. <laughs> Come hither. Point. Bonds of life maintain order. Yay. You wish them broken. I cannot allow this. Cool, so he's going to eat us. We'll pay for all the souls you've consumed. Point. Return them all. Prepare to die. Alright, this is gonna be a real boss. Real crazy stage. Yep. Oh, and I have to fight him as her yes, after everything we've done. Ooh, look Dude. how sick he is. Uh, Every okay. other character I could oh. be, I would rather be using Bud right now, right. like oh. easily. Oh shit! Uh, okay. Ow! Didn't hit him one time. Okay. He will go across the screen up ten times. He seems he like he's already almost dead. Probably because at least there's. Ew. Uh, he hit me with that, so I might be just I down. Think he just hit Doug too. Oh, okay. All that—that that did like no damage. He might might have a high wind resistance. Yeah. That wouldn't surprise me at all. The guy has dragon. It's hard to hit too. Like you think you gotta hit him on the knee. Yeah, it's right here. Strange. Yeah. On his belly butt. Sorry, I think I messed that up for you. No. No. Okay. Now he's in a perfect position to use the attack. That's okay. Oh, God! Jump, jump. I don't think you want to be there. Yeah. Doug, get out of there. Doug dodged Doug just it. Walked past it. An artful dodge from yeah, Doug. Doug rocks, dude. So we wanted to ditch him out. Ow. I mean, he did dodge it, but he also didn't really do anything. Oh, now he's dead. Oh, I'm down. You gotta okay. finish it. Oh, okay. There we go. I would stop you. Oh no. Okay, no. that was a meaningful got... amount of damage. Uh, it's gonna be, yeah. That one okay. Again. No, you dodged it. You're fine. I, think I got him. I think you got him too. Is there a phase two? No, I think he just goes into the fiery void. This game has has not had phase it twos. Had one phase two with Shajara. Yeah. Which is weird, to say the least. This um boss kind of sucks by yourself though. It's really oh, I'm not sure. That fun if you get caught under him too many times, but it's not undoable. No experience. No experience, yeah. no loot. It's the friends we made along the way. Okay. Sit in silence for a minute while it decides. Oh, is this going to destroy the, the whole zone? Yeah. Yeah. That makes sense. Yeah. Can we play something else new here, or does it just become ruins? Uh, it just becomes the underworld again. Oh. Uh, yeah. Okay. Just his temporary castle. No. Nope. Which kind of sucks. Wait. Yeah, oh, okay. It just seals up it again. It kind of sucks because, like, I like the castle and I think it would be a cool area to be able to go to to farm. Mm hmm. So there's a lot of dragons in there. And on higher levels, they definitely drop, like, some really nice stuff. But you just can't. Lark's uh, just fine now. Yeah. It's nice and sunny out. Kind of like the 
Yeah. Oh, we're going to have this emotional moment in silence. My favorite thing about this game. Yep. So, Blood Curse from this moment forth for 1,000 years. I must remain trapped in the underworld of Draconis. Okay. Great. Oh, sounds like a bad relationship, honestly. <laughs> that sucks. How terrible. She's like, yes, I don't have to. Are you telling me they have a dramatic theme and they've had it this whole time and they just don't use it? <laughs> what? I'm mad now. Dude, the amount of times we've sat in silence for moments like this and they've had a theme just ready to go and they just don't use it. Yeah. <sighs> also, I'm not controlling the text. Um, the game is. Uh-huh. So he's telling her to go back to the forest, go back to your own business. Mm -hmm. I mean, what are you going to do for a thousand years while he's down there? Also, um, yeah, you should probably say sorry to her. Pay you a visit in due course. How nice of you. I'll visit you in jail. <laughs> I can't believe there's been a dramatic theme this whole time and they just don't use I it. I feel like this theme only matches them though. I don't feel like it matches any of the other ones because you get this big long scene. So now she's gonna go apologize. Hey, what's up, dude? It matches dramatic things better than just silence though. So, Crafter's back. Jara's back. The dragons are just back? I guess. Or cool. their spirits are back enough to manifest them. Okay. I don't know about this guy, dude, though. This like, guy seems just evil, he's though. He's a bad guy, yeah. Maybe he just looks evil. I think they've confined him to his dad's skull forever. Uh-huh. To basically live there in, like, sadness with the monostone because... He is this arc what the him. anime is based on? No, it's the Jimmy arc that it's based on. Oh. Which we're gonna see soon. Okay. Spoilers. <laughs> hey, what's up? Viewers still know that the siblings will finally be reunited. She closes her eyes, goes to sleep. Mm, Granny Dragon. Done. Yep, and that guy is just. That guy is forever. dead now. Yeah, his dragon is really cool, though. His dragon form. You only get to see it once. It's kind of a shame. Mm -hmm. Okay. Gonna go Hit the orchards. the orchard. The orchard countdown. Yeah. Just get some seeds. Maybe. Mm hmm. Uh, I bet I'm still in control of girl, aren't I? I don't know if you're with me. Sir. Let's find out if I'm still in control of girl. Nope. No, I'm not. Completely Ooh, randomly, no. I am not. See? That's yeah. new. Mask. Potatoes. A masked potato. Dumb. Very dumb. Actually. Ugh. And I have no idea what I did to get that. Nope. It just. Uh, well, I mean. Uh, and also the the pepper shoe. I don't know what that the thing is called. The pair of heels. No, nope, I've gotten that. Pair of heels. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I've gotten it before. So Not we're just. Uh, are we hitting the farming and then? Shutting it down? I think so. I think it's a good place to call it. Do you want me to shut it down right here and you can do the harvest off screen? Yeah, that's no fine. reason we not to. Subject everyone to this uh You'll see farm them torture. again next time, I'm sure. <laughs> yes. Um Thanks for watching. Uh I hope you're enjoying it so far. <laughs> appreciate you guys sticking with us. Uh and we you know, still have at least at, at least three more episodes, right? Maybe Possibly? I mean, Maybe two. I feel like we blasted through quite a few quests this time. Yeah, like you said, some of them like cascade and finish up. Yeah, like they're literally just talking and walking around. Mm -hmm. So I tried to get those done as fast as possible. Yeah. Yeah. So anyway. Anyway. See you guys next time. Bye. Bye.